I stream on YouTube again. It's amazing how Twitch just works, but YouTube gives me these assholes. Yeah, a nightmare jungle. He wanted us to- he wanted to hear us talk about the Avatar stuff, but... You know, this is why, you know, anytime anybody ever asks me, what should I watch on YouTube or Twitch? YouTube, I'm, I'm always, I usually say preference, but I always lean towards Twitch, because it's just, it's just better, you know? It's not my opinion, it's just time and time, time after time, Twitch is the more consistently stable option, better viewing experience. Even in Plankerton, or whatever this is, canny. 25 nuts and bolts from a bird. I love it. What's better than the Deatomizer? The Discharger? The Xenon Bow? The Santa's Little Helper? The... I don't know, there's lots of weapons. I linked my videos if you want full stories. All right! I'll be right back with homemade skeddy. All right. I'm going to link Factor in chat. If you guys want to check it out, it would support me greatly. Make the advertiser happy. You get some nice cheap meals delivered straight to your door. Two minutes to microwave and you're good to go. No prep necessary. No prep, no mess. Just grab a fork and enjoy. I'm going to just wait here if we're not going to do it as quick. <laughs> Uh, he's on a bebop mission right now. Yeah, I see. Hi, chat. Hopefully everyone's doing Hello, well. Hello, chat. You gotta put up with me and T's in a voice call. <laughs> Deal with our shit. Shade, shade and, uh, shade and someone else can relate to that. <laughs> Deal with but yeah, someone was talking about the deatomizer, and I was, <laughs> I wanted to say this because if, if Shade is still in chat, very funny. Of the deatomizer is obsolete, not unlike yeah. the bundle bus. There, I said it. Hate me, chat, but I will forever stand by the fact that I believe that the bundle bus, while it is still a very good AR, pretty much obsolete in our state of the game. I will forever stand by that. It's unfortunate because it's a fun weapon, but. Other weapons do its job better. Exactly. Yeah. <sighs> like, ever since the Deatomizer, no, not Deatomizer, uh, Discharger came out, just that weapon has been obsolete. <laughs> well, it's not even. Well, yeah, the Deatomizer has been obsolete. Discharger. This is showing me that I've been gone for too long. I played in two years, but the last time I played the Deatomizer was. Yeah, Deatomizer was really good. And then um, other weapons came out. And discoveries are made about the game. And yeah, that's why that's why I was saying the bundle bus is pretty much obsolete now. Is we've learned a lot more about the game and weapons have changed and it hasn't necessarily gotten worse. It's just that have gotten better. It's still a good weapon. Don't get rid of it, but you're not gonna be. It's not the weapon you necessarily have to. Is there a hero in the game that can increase uh, Shadow Stance duration? Uh, hmm, maybe. Can I don't anyone, actually know. Can anyone uh, search that up? <laughs> yeah, that's that's a good question. I'm, I actually don't know. There is Maple. Thank you. Oh, nice Maple. I'm back. You know what? Without back. food, Red wasn't ready. Hello, back. <laughs> this fucking guy. So, I think we both made the same. Is joke. YouTube working yet? Um, it was working. The stream is all fine and everything. Chat's back up as well. I don't even have my own. I'm trying out the shadow stance build that you were using, and is that you kicking? Is that you doing some great damage? That's what surprised me too. I may try something though. I may. Do a shadow stance hero that can dirt that can extend shadow stance and support. Uh, that's not possible. Oh, I thought there was a hero that can extend a uh, shadow stance uh, duration. No, it's a team perk. Oh. Oh right, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Now I know what you're talking about. Okay. Then I thought lose. there was a hero for that. Then you lose Blakebeard stash. That's no good. 
You're gonna be running MSK. Nope. Yeah, 15,000 nuts and bolts. Who are you talking to? Cool, I guess. Storm God is unimpressed with your nuts and bolts. You should get more. You should you should make a monopoly out of it or a business. I don't encourage Save the World players to do that. <laughs> they will misinterpret what you mean. That was a joke. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it, it's fine. But yeah. So many asses in my YouTube chat. You know, <laughs> as annoying as porn bots are. Oh, you mean the comments, right? What did you think I meant? You, cause oh you said God. YouTube chat and I looked at it. Elmeo, you mentioned that a few hundred nuts and bolts was good. I was talking about from an expedition. Clicking a few buttons, oh, yeah, reference, one minute sweet. of setup, and a few hundred nuts and bolts. That's a W right there. Anyone YouTube is working right. Collect coconuts. I got, I got a bunch right here. Nightmare Jungle wanted to talk about Avatar. I can talk all about. I actually abandoned the Netflix one. That I haven't. That was no good. I mean, it was. It looked. Yeah, I have a lot to say. I'll be right back. Hopefully with bread this time. <sighs> I never actually got. Hopefully food. with food. Oh, chat. Beautiful. Show us again. Um, Storm God is unimpressed with your nuts. <laughs> oh Astro, my God. what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Come on. Well, well, I got like 6k. I mean, yeah, like I have a crap ton of nothing, but it's like three, a like, few hundred for an expedition is solid. Like, I'll say this, I mentioned it already, I'll mention it again. Not some, you can get a ton of metal and stuff from doing encampments and things, more than you might think. Oh, boy. Hi, Archer. <laughs> Not Archer, or bad. My brain autopiloted oh, into a different name. Why did you assume I was Archer? I don't know. Um, he said that, not me. I'm just the messenger. I... Wait, what did does Warcry say? give the perks to your teammates? It does, Zaku. Warcry is a team buffing perk. Yeah, but it can increase your melee attack speed. Which is good for the melee builds. Oh, got a flinger. You should definitely not destroy your nuts and bolts, dude. Keep them. Yes. It's a resource <laughs> you'll get a ton of, and then you might. And we were, and we were just joking. <laughs> And we were just joking, okay? Don't take every, don't take was, everything that we say like uh, to an offense. <laughs> I wasn't. What's the best thing you can get from an expedition? I have gotten Swordmaster Ken and Mega Base Kyle from an expedition. However, that's a really. Oh, um... let me, let me, let me annihilate like, the mini boss. Oh yeah. All right. Yeah. Mega, oh, getting those heroes. Oh, it's nature. Rare because. In order to get a hero like that, you need to run one of the epic expeditions, and it has to succeed. Did he get a meal prep again? Hmm? Did hmm? we get a meal prep again? Uh, I think so. No, they have spaghetti. Oh, no. my spaghetti. Oh, that's and now I'm craving some spaghetti, but I also, my brother bought uh, French <laughs> bread. Uh, I'm gonna... I'm gonna be making some ramen later tonight. Hell yeah. Yeah, my brother has some uh, French bread. Damn, didn't know you could get heroes in a mythic one. It's the thing is, epic expeditions are so hard to get. They're so rare. And the odds of you finishing them are so low. However, the only two that I ever remember getting, I have succeeded on both. Okay. When I, which is astronomical odds, but possible. I always send them when it's like a 30%. I, I, I don't, don't care. If I don't really running. run expeditions anymore. Why? Like, you should. I, I know, but just there's... take it from every billionaire ever. You can always have more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, too true.
I had to stop running expeditions. My inventory was just full of nuts and bolts, and I thought, okay, 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 okay. this is not yeah. necessary. This is too much. See, this is why I'm actually know. embarrassed to say this, but I'm actually low on rough ore. And what are That's we talking about I've right been now? I've running low on. I've run up. You could low just on click, ore. click, click. Is that some. Send yeah, some heroes out. I think out. after. I think like late tonight, I'll probably just do a massive rough ore grind with Clip. No, you can just send an expedition and then just recycle the weapons that come back or whatever. I only ever ran one expedition? Maple! Did you just run it for like the quest in Stonewood and then- We're saying you can get rough war without even playing the game. Yeah. As we saw from how people felt about the daily login, love being able to get stuff without playing. Hey Matthew! So. My lobby is usually people who are on my friends list. How do you get such high hardware damage? Because I do like nothing in MSK. Sam, what's your power level? You guys want to come pick up coconuts and uh, cannonballs? Go this right is ahead. a mission with 24 seconds left. <laughs> In a 58 zone where we're all sure, over leveled. Hey, Fusion. <laughs> You're 127? I just, I just want to have fun. <laughs> He's trying to drive those hustles. It might be the weapon. Never ran expeditions. I use, wow. Yeah, you never need to, but they certainly are worth it. I'm, I'm talking about the effort here. TJ's low on rough ore. You're, you just pull up a red box expedition, couple of crap heroes he doesn't even use, and then mm -hmm. check back tomorrow. Boom, rough ore. <laughs> it's just that easy. Yeah. Or, and, not or, you uh, recycle weapons. You get so much shit. It's so good. Or just get maples in the lobby and then you get thousands. Thanks for making out, Jungle. Sorry that the stream was being weird tomorrow, or weird, but. The Twitch link is at the top. Definitely the more consistent place to view the stream. Ah, um, the emotes. Good the showtime Lord, emote. Wow. Just hearing tease. Yeah, somebody else heard that. Oh, God, God. What? Come up there. Yeah, planks are... Look at this. Those two had the two emotes I actually wanted. The Rasputin and the, uh, the Showtime emote. Take a breath. Breathe. They are scarring me. Be alright. Look at this. I know. Planks are the most used resource in the game for traps. Yeah. I, that did not surprise me when we went over that. I was like, that absolutely tracks. And rough War might not be the most, but... These are some of the most common traps in the game. Yeah. Unfortunately, including Flame Grill. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you said common, not good, and Flame... Again, unfortunately, very common. I don't need to like it, but it is true that Flame Grills are very popular. Best perks for the Fury? If you do exclamation point Fury, you'll see them. <laughs> Your daily from yesterday made me laugh when you just like... Like... Oh, there we go. Sorry, Trevor in YouTube chat is offering his rough war for planks, TJ. A little oh, swap. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> the only trading I ever support. Yeah. Two high-level players trading resources. <laughs> See, that's actually that's fine. fine. All right, Stonewood 15. Are you guys going to be okay without my help? <laughs> I think we will be okay. Uh, Jeez, get those coconuts, me. buddy. Although Maples yeah, is offering for free, get... though, so... Yeah, that, uh, that does that though. I mean, yeah, I mean that's fine. I mean, See, TJ, oh, I, I will get something. I'll get something in return. You play this right, and you can make them work for it. You know. <laughs> How do you get a fish? <laughs> kind of against each TJ. other. Who wants to give me rough war the most? Pretty sure that's bad, <laughs> make right? it like a make it like a a shark tank type thing. Mm hmm Free stacks. I should. I will look at offer mine. the highest bid. <laughs> Okay, don't, yeah. I'll drop you a thousand no, 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 sunbeam no. if I can drop you some bright, some rough ore. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. Sorry. Yeah, right? I'm joking. <laughs> give me all of your planks and I'll give you 5,000 bright quartz. Like, okay. That's a bad trade. You've been hoarding them since Stonewood? 9,000 planks? Jeez. I'm just, yeah, planks are, planks are the most common trap resource. They're the one that I find I'm always farming. Audi and Falcon, you two are going to scar me with those two emotes, I swear. Onslaught Sunbeam. Get some food. Onslaught Sunbeam. 
Sin Electric Thunder Field's great. I ranked it my the number one trap in the game. So this is the most versatile. The ceiling trap. Yeah, Sam, and I hope you can figure that out. Sometimes we have a Warcry user. I'm excited to use Oswald in the 160s. Momo, I got you. Oh, there we go. <sighs> Garlic bread! Yeah! I went upstairs and mom said the bread wasn't ready yet. And I said, why'd you text me Skeddy? And I don't know what she said, but... Is that garlic bread a beast? Sharing is caring. Uh, it is garlic bread. I can actually share nice. a 50% off link for Factor 75. There you go. Order with that link, I get a kickback, you get cheap food. I actually may need to check that out, because some of the stuff that you looked earlier on that site, man. I would really appreciate that. I was hoping for six signups with this campaign, and we are not there. <laughs> so, it would really mean a lot. And I actually give a yeah, shit. Definitely. If you give me feedback on your meals when they arrive, I'd love to, love to hear it. Yeah, mom, mom got a new, it's not an air fryer, some kind of special oven that sits on the counter, I don't know. Dad got it for Christmas, and they have been making good use of it, so garlic bread was cooking that, so nice and crispy. Crop pot? Hmm? Oh, uh, wait, hold a on. Crop, I can use my Xenombo for this. Crockpot is for fluids, Aura. Oh. That's not where you make crispy garlic bread. What the hell is my brother doing? That's a good question. I'm glad she didn't give me that much, actually. It's probably raging again, Rainbow Six. <laughs> I'm making everybody in chat hungry. I don't think I've seen my brother play any other games but Rainbow Six and uh, NBA. What better time to make my chat hungry than when I have a food sponsor on stream? Yeah, you're making us you're making us hungry out here. I get a lot of what I call gamer hunger, where I'm hungry enough to be annoyed by it, but it doesn't stop me from playing my game. So I just get worse and worse, and I, I know I need to eat when I'm ignoring caves and Tears of the Kingdom. It's like, I don't feel like exploring that, I'm hungry. It's like, okay, alright, fucking pause. Go get some food. Alright. AS wants deep red delicious pasta sauce filling the floor with a warm tinge from the ceiling. What the hell? What? Any V-Bug missions in 40DB is right down right now? Yeah, I make my daily video every day. I show them in my daily right video. Now. Doing thousands of melee damage to Horn. Yeah, I guess you just needed to perk it right. When you crit, it does Wow, my whole thing looks different now. You guys are seeing it like with the real color. I'm seeing like pink spaghetti right now. Hey, Jeffy. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you, Fodic. What mission are you referring to? Because I'm very curious.
Oh yeah. I keep I keep a drawer full of extra paper towels ready to go. I have not cleaned this mouse pad in five years. Because I don't get sauce on it. It was yesterday. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know. Are these normal husks hitting it down in three hits? There's meat left now. Now I can't get a purchase. <laughs> oh, I'm struggling. <laughs> Not enough. Grave Digger or Ranger? Completely different weapons. Both are fun for their certain moods. A loadout related question. I am always open to questions. It's when people ask me if they can ask a question that I get I get I get mean. Water and I had it built with metal and there wasn't even metal corrosion. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Oh yeah, Golden Texas. It was mom's spaghetti. I could be answering that question right now. But instead they asked me if they could ask mom's it. Mom's spaghetti. Oh. I want to be in CG, but I don't need caffeine anymore. I might make a hydration drink. Peach mango could be good. Hmm. Hmm. I might. I think I'm gonna. Alright. I'll be right back. Alright. Hello chat, we are here to entertain you while this team is happening. Yeah, me, Aura, and... Oh, just us. Stormgod's Storm uh, deaf. Yeah. So, ask us anything. We'll do our best to answer your question. We would answer your question to the best of our abilities. <laughs> And Maple, I'll happily take your offer on the rough four. <laughs> hello, Phonic. Uh, hello. Hello, Nitro. Hello, Nitro. I'm gonna ask you a question about asking you a question about something. Uh, no, because that's just going to make it overly complicated. <laughs> overly just complicated. Me, just, just ask me the question. Uh, uh both of y'all's favorite missions and why. Uh, or why not you go first with that question? What's my favorite mission? I have not played Save the World in so long that I can't really say, like, what's my favorite mission. And they're just kind of all the same to me. It's just... Yeah, you, you, you set up a, you set up a defense and then you uh, fight the bad guys when they come in and then you kill them. I think my, my favorite mission is uh, retreat the data, because I feel like I feel like a surge of like like chaos whenever the storm's closing in on you and you have to like like fight in like tighter areas. However, if you were to ask me my least favorite mission, I would say. We're Repair the shelter. Oh, that's interesting. I fucking hate that mission. <laughs> uh, I find it to be so boring. J, J, J X. Uh, I don't know how to say your name, dude. I'm sorry. He's asking what our favorite games are. Well, I my, think my favorite games is uh, or go ahead, or my bad. My favorite game of all time is Hades, but uh, the. My recent favorite gaming experience uh, was Persona 3 Reload, which came out uh, last month, and I had a blast with it. 
Oh, nice. I think my favorite uh, game, well, I guess like kind of story game is uh, is the Batman Arkham series. It's one of my it was one of my favorite games growing up, and I actually started playing them again recently, and it really took me back. Like, I was just blown away by how good the Arkham series was. Too bad R Rock City is not doing any good games anymore, but hey, they'll always be legacy. It really was a uh, fall deck if it favorite Arkham game. Uh that's very tough. I like all three of them, but I think if you like, you know, twist my uh arm and force me to choose, then I guess uh Arkham City. But Arkham Knight was is right up there, like the tippity tippity top. I honestly, I, I could I could switch those two games out to be honest. I bought all the Arkham games because I saw my I saw my sale for a good bargain. I'm like, well, I'm not gonna buy these. I haven't touched them yet, but right now they're so right now they're just in my backlog waiting, waiting to be played. I bought them again on Steam because uh, I I got all three Arkham games for like like nine dollars. It was on sale for like 85 off. To answer the question that someone has in chat, and I, I did answer it in chat a little bit, Lego Star Wars Complete Saga is my favorite Lego game. Same. Like, now and forever. Yep. Yeah, that will be the probably the only Lego game that I'll ever play. Ever. <laughs> guy's talking about Lego games. Are you shaking that thing up, beast? You know, one of the few you know, games I ever 100%ed was Skywalker Saga. Really? Wow. I have 100% on that game. I 100%ed was uh, Clone Wars, and then it was Complete Saga. Oh, you did both? Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. That's whatever, you know. Hey, I uh, guess some of us touch grass and, you know. I, I try. Have you ever played an Arkham <laughs> game before, uh, Batman? No. Uh. Ah! There they, there they go. Doing those emotes I really wanted. For five minutes. The oh. Ceiling lights are so dim that I don't even see. <clears throat> if I have hella G fuel, my dad's obsessed with it. He has like 30 plus tubs. You might want to try advanced GG, Momo. I have heard a 100% positive ratio. Like, every time I've ever heard anybody try them both, Advanced CG came out on top. It's no sugar, it's better for you. Um... It's very delicious. Mm -hmm. It's worth a try, Momo. Take it, take it from me. If he's 30 plus tubs committed to G Fuel, he might not turn, but... I don't know. He might. He might prefer Advanced CG. He might not turn. Not really, Fodeg. You just run double reload on them and you're good to go. Alright, let's level up uh, Major Oswald for the first time ever. I... It's exciting, I isn't it? I kept to detain it while you were gone. Did Ty join the call? No, she did not. God. Uh, Somebody from no. the bar sounded exactly like Ty. That was weird. Oh, yeah, I can hear you guys from across the room, by the way. That's the beautiful thing about speakers. I can be so far away and make sure Aura is behaving. Why me? What did I do? Oh. Nothing yet, the but only, I'm keeping an eye on the you. The only thing that we've been doing is asking chat uh, questions. Or, I mean, well, chat asking questions to us. What should we run? I don't care. I want to try, but I ain't got no money. Well, bring it up to your dad, honestly. Hey, if you get a parent interested in these things, it's smooth sailing. Like, I, I actually benefit from that. My mom will just order stuff. <laughs> She'll just get advanced CG and I'll just casually borrow it. You know, like, I, I, I do get free advanced CG product, but 
there's a limit on that. So sometimes she'll get <laughs> she'll get her own flavors, and I'm like, can I? Uh... So like when when sachets were a dollar each, she ordered eighty of them. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Fucking eighty of them, and and slid me twenty four of them. I was like, thanks, mom. What am I running with Major Oswald? I don't even know. I guess what I could do whatever. Do? Weapon damage. Uh, okay. He's, he Ride the lightning. and increases weapon damage. Water. I'm just gonna use my ranger. Oh, it's fire though. God damn it. I can't Here, keep switching a... around. I don't know. This... I don't know if Cloak Shot will be good for 160. I'll probably not do that. I'll just go with the... Oh my god, this is a water mission, right? I made this mistake before. Okay, water and water. Okay, good. What's your favorite flavor? My mom and dad are just... They're way past favorite flavors. They mix and match so much. Um, I think... I really don't know. They both like... Well, that's unproductive to say a flavor that's not out anymore. I really like strawberry shortcake. That's my favorite. Oh my god, okay, there's the question. How many stream before I anyway, forcing vacuum tube bow into fire element missions and been wondering which of the two supports could result in more DPS icy shot or quick scope. Wait, what are you talking about? Icy shot. You're Is using that... you're using you must be using Zenith. Seventeen percent damage would be much better than Is Icy Shot Zenith? Uh let me check real quick. I'm already on it. Um Oh. Oh yeah, that is. Oh, that's uh, a good question. Cause he applies water affliction, which might do good damage to fire enemies. And I think freezing enemies makes them uh, take more damage, right? Uh, I think they're using him in support. That's interesting, Bimo. If you are force, <clears throat> if you are forcing a vacuum tube bow into a wa into a fire zone. Zenith might actually be better, because normally, traditionally, Redline would be better, but 17% being cut down by 75% is not that helpful anymore. So Icy Shot, I think, would be far and away better. Yeah, that's honestly pretty interesting. I might I might go with all this Assassin. Interesting, I guess. Thanks for hanging out, Fodic. My dream is to play a match with you. What hero would you voucher this time of the year? Oh. Clip. Clip is a very popular voucher right now. Oh, can I turn my lights back on now? Yeah. Clip is like the best hero that's super far away. Crackshot's really good too. But Crackshot's less essential. Clip will fund everything forever. <laughs> Crackshot's just a fun commander. I'm gonna use coconuts. Dun dun dun! Coconuts? What? Beast, you're crazy! You couldn't possibly imagine using such a obsolete perk. <laughs> oh my god. Insane man. Okay, I, oh, no. I changed my ranger and I still think I might do the nocturnal anyway. <clears throat> Beast, I have a weird question. Of course you do. You don't have to answer. Always asking me strange shit, telling me things I already know. <laughs> Um, Ranger or Bundle Bus? Yeah, I know I didn't need to answer that. Ranger. Bundle Bus is obsolete. <laughs> I don't think there's any reason yeah. to use the, bu the Bundle Bus anymore. You hear that, Shade? Seriously, everything the Bundle Bus did, the Xenon Bow just does better nowadays. Mm. Like, everything we used it for is outclassed by Xenon Bow. Yeah. I made a tier list of each of the range weapon classes, and I put the Bundle Bus below the Ranger, and Piper, Shade, and a few others crap for it and I'm like are you serious I checked I yeah, glanced not... at two of your tier lists and I found myself surprisingly in agreement I just had nothing no use war cry radius I think it should be fine I actually don't know how to tell when they're in range what is the normal war cry radius I'm playing undertale right now but I thought I'd drop by welcome welcome I like it when people uh, put innator in their name Every Jake in the world is just better when it's Jake and Ader. Yeah, within four tiles is Warcry. 
Yeah, Photic, I don't think it's changed, though, Floor Launcher. I mean, like, it can't launch enemies in the air, but it's not that big of a deal. Do you have a link to your uh, tier list, the uh, Storm God? Man, if you already... look up my message history, though, Man, here. Damn it. Uh, in my Murder favorite game? Or... Open World Zelda Yeah, they're games. in VIP. I can okay. reproduce them elsewhere, but yeah. Yeah, um, yeah, let me, let me check. Alright. Holy tower. So let's see this damage, everybody. Okay, so. Alright. Alright, they're dead. I'm watching you from above. Oh, that's awkward. So it looks like I'm critting for... 83. Alright, alright, alright. Let's pop a war cry here. Ooh. Wow. Oh, damn, I, I see the red oh, mark or Oh, something. oh, oh, they're well marked, okay. Oh, oh you can see them walk like into range now, right? Yeah, it's like it's like the instigator whenever you shoot it and the red marker the uh, the pierce. Oh, is this this is uh Oswald. Got, well that was a lot of extra damage. I, I need to find a smasher. Smasher, I hardly know her. Okay. Alright. Well time to time to pull out the Matteo and just uh, go up for one kiss. <laughs> Literally almost every time I help him out with like testing stuff, I always find the smash for him. Yeah, Xena, uh, Neon Sniper is really good for that. Ah, Taker's gonna die too quick. Uh, yeah, let's just do this. Big crowd of men. Ooh, look at them all highlighted. Damn. So it's not highlighted, and then I get. Oh, and then it is. That's really strong. And of oh, course, you're war cried, so you're already doing more anyway. Wait, are you just running all the uh, war cry heroes? Pretty much. I got sludge and support and coconuts. This Vatry clip, uh, she gives so much battery. Yeah, clip is great. Nailer or Nocturno? Nocturno, obviously, does more damage. Don't you say you have a question? <laughs> just ask a question. Oh, that's true. <laughs> what the? What, what is that? What did I miss? Well, no, I'm just processing why someone would go to make a compare- ask for a nailer turn of comparison. Oh, yeah, I'm just moving oh, past it. Goodness, I think- hurt. Somewhere around three tiles. I think position- hmm. I think position actually offered me, like, a hundred bucks or something if I got a copy of the nailer and supercharged it. I would supercharge I for a hundred dollars. Musician! Musician! <laughs> I, I, okay, I don't know if he actually said that. Is that bounty I think still he up? Did one time. Musician. Musician. I want a hundred dollars. I'll supercharge anything. Oh shit! I, I got I frozen. How many containers do I have to search to oh, get coconuts? No. It's like that shrimp song. How many shrimp do you have to eat? I'll stop there. Oh no. On average, 16. I was not being serious. I don't need an average. I need right now. I'm at 6. Mm. Ah, coconuts. Why do you have to be so good? Hi, Coconut Man in the lead. I just searched so many things with the coconuts. Yeah, isn't it still 20% in the lead? Okay, alright, I'm good. You know what, I'm kind of excited. Oh, damage to slowed and snared. Yes, okay. Alright, chat. So, hard for a sec. so this snares everything. Ready? Eat a coconut. War cry. Oh. That's pretty much what I expected. That was fun. Anytime you get to buff the Discharger, it's a good time. Affliction, everybody. Affliction. It's always Affliction tempting, you know? King. You think you need to keep shooting, but you don't. Yeah, the problem with Major is he doesn't help you with the, versus the Storm King Horn. Now, wow. if it gave you just the 25% bonus and the snare on top of it at the start, then it could probably make a difference. 
Wow, this is a fun ability. I mean, I'm just bullying 160s, but. And it's got not unlimited range, which is kind of a big deal. But I don't want to burn a support perk increasing that range. I've already burned three of my support, reducing the cooldown of Warcry. I don't like that. Ranger Nocturno. Why is that the second time I'm getting that question in the last 10 minutes? You know what? I don't do this weapon or that weapon. If you're going to ask me a question, you need to have a subject and a verb. Ranger or Nocturno has a subject. What's the verb? Are you asking me which one's better? Which one I prefer? Which one I like using? Which one you should use? Which one you should level up? Which weapon you should flux? Which weapon you should voucher? Which weapon you should trade for? I don't... What do you... Which one would look better in an anime? Better. Better for what? Damage? Aesthetics? Preference? Clearing crowds? You're allowed to type more than two words. I know I'm being a dick, but I've gotten this question a million times and I never know what people want from me. Oops, yeah, I don't know what you want here. B says trading. And that, chat, is the art of taking things out of context. Ignoring everything else I just said. They bring back your VCG shaker, I'll buy some. That's awesome. Well, maybe we should get that going. Not some bolts and I think both of those are confirmed. That's a pretty good range. And it looks like you can walk into it. Yeah, it looks like it's affected enemies. It looks like it's enemies that are affected when you war cry. I don't know if it's... I don't know. I've never liked war cry heroes for the obvious reasons. Um, what would it take to have an IRL default dance? I don't know. I'm not comfortable dancing on camera, so. Cost, uh, more money than it's worth to get me to really in the middle of the defense? Really? I mean, that's fitting as hell, but... That's, that's where that antenna spawns. <laughs> Is that gonna stop us from building? I'm not muted, Chad. I've never seen a spawn like that. Yeah, I'd hope not, Squid, because once the defense begins, oh. enemies are going to be running into your Warcry range, and I... I don't know. Can we still build? Maybe... Warcry snares enemies within its range by 30% for its duration. Additionally, affected enemies take weapon... God, that wording is so precise and so vague. Are you looking for coconuts just stealing all my shit? God damn it, don't follow me into a cave and open containers. They limited me to eight now, so I have to restock. I probably don't need to restock, but... Anyway, Storm God! Storm God, what the fuck? Nocturno is hugely stronger than the Ranger. But I like the Ranger more. Because it's more fun to use. Now, they're both fun to use. Who gives a shit? Run whatever you want. People ask me all the time to compare stuff, and it's so pointless. Just oh, one more of you think it's good to you, or I, I get it's fun to you. Kind of defensive about it because it's like, I feel like a decision is being made when people ask me that. It's like, no, I use them interchangeably. <clears throat> I use both weapons often. Nocturno is ridiculously strong. Like, stronger than it should be because of a bug that we found, well, I say we, somebody found out recently. Apparently that little explosion at the end there is doing way more than it should be. I, um, no, it better not be when it first came out. When the it's first, always when been the a bug. Expert, so. it's, it's been discovered that, that that boom that it does, it does do 36% or 65% of the damage, but... That boom can also crit as if it, it was its own attack. Oh. So it does way more than it's supposed to. 
But not like like ten million or something like that. No, more like three million. Oh. It's a lot. Damn. That could take like roughly seventy five percent of a of You can a kill a smasher problems. that's power level two fifty in about five bullets. That's crazy. I I I don't think the Hustbuster can do that. Uh maybe not five bullets, but six. Don't let Epic hear. Yeah, I don't even know. Why do you always use Alexa skin? Why do you love juice boxes? <laughs> that's that's like someone saying to me, why are you using the Zo skin all the time? Uh, I don't know. Would you believe me if I said I liked the skin? I know. I like answering Super Vag though, because the audacity to suggest that I even need a reason to like a skin is humorous. Ty is saying, give me a hundred dollars to defeat my puzzle and survival's addiction if you, that you caused. I didn't cause shit. I got you onto a fun game during a sponsor period. You're the one who started burning money on the game. That's, I did not ask you to do that. Yeah, Ty was actually trying to get me on that, uh, on that thing as well, whenever we were in a VC. Just... I mean, Ty, if you get me on that addiction, then it's on you, okay? I'm just, I'm just saying. Yeah, so it doesn't look like enemies can walk in range. That makes me hate this perk. No, oh, it looks like, no, it, it looks like it does apply. I think two people using Major Oswald switching off would be big. Yeah, alternating between roll cries, I think, will probably make it better. So this is where a lesser player would start saving their coconuts for some reason. You gotta remember, they last about 30 seconds, so... <clears throat> gotta use them up. Alright. There you go, pop a war cry. That's pretty good. It's not exactly oh, yeah. blowing my hair back, because again, I have to lose so many damage perks that I'd otherwise be enjoying because I had to put all those war cry reductions and support. It's not worth the trade-off. A traditional build is way better than this, but it's fun, so. And an enemy behind Blaster given illusions of it being debuffed. Maybe. We'll find out. Yeah, and then it's off cooldown. I'm just useless again, so. Bad time for Discharger. Make him stop for some reason. Ah, that didn't work. So now I pop it, and nothing is marked. Nothing's marked. It doesn't look like anything's being applied. Disappointing. Many bosses can be snared and stunned, slow to the smoke bomb. Uh, the slow effect on the Discharger doesn't apply to mini-bosses, though. Look at this. Not affected, not affected. AS did say it doesn't go through walls. That might be what I'm experiencing. Lame. I don't like abilities like this, where... <coughs> there's so much setup that you need to be aware of, and it's not always worth it. That's what I figured, I guess. My main team perk right now is Happy Holidays, so maybe Dennis Jr. Dennis Jr. would be more helpful. He comes out relatively soon in the summer months, but let's try Nocturno. Now 
Now is it just not affecting enemies at all? I'm also losing a team perk. I'm running Happy Holidays and three of my support perks for Oswald. This is not worth it. That's the other sacrifice you need to, you know, take in order to run this. Nah, worth it. Clip and Dennis Jr. I don't know, dude. Are you low on resources? You don't need Clip to farm. If you just do anomalies and encampments and kill animals and loot and recycle their loot, like you really don't need to farm at all. Dennis Jr. might go a lot further. <clears throat> it's kind of amazing the more research I've been doing and looting in this game, the more I'm realizing that I don't think anybody ever needs a farming loadout. <laughs> Maybe when you're just getting started, but... <clears throat> Enemies, storm chests, um, looting animals, passive stuff around the map, like, you don't need anything. Oh, ricochet, lovely, okay. Maybe I'll wait for my war cry, and then I'll minigun. Yeah, I haven't even needed my coconuts. Whoa. Oh, my God. Whoa. That was fun. Oh, Smasher hugged me. Oh, no. I'm coming back. For what? Uh, my way. Don't die. There we go. I run out of batteries if I'm using Scourge, gotta farm more. That's true. <clears throat> you gotta take it easy on those energy weapons. I'm not getting the red arrow notification at all now. Yeah, I don't see it on my screen because at the start of the game I was seeing it, but now I'm not. What changed? Maybe it's bugged or I don't know. There's no way that he's bugged. It might be a visual thing. He might stop working entirely if you get blocked by something. At any point? What does that even mean? Well, well that's something, another, another bug that F needs to fix. <laughs> Could be visual. It's weird to test because obviously enemies are dying quicker because I just popped a war cry. Yeah, with Warcry and, uh, imagine if Sledgehammer got a uh, Warcry instead of, like, grenades or, <clears throat> or minigun, then he would be ten times better. Hmm. Is the farming loadout good for the start of Of course. Ventures, yeah. But, I'm just saying, if you loot casually, you don't need it. Well, I'm not a fan of that. Well, I tried. I thought I... <clears throat> I thought I might have been wrong about him, but... Not so much. All right. Well, no more Major Oswald. Maybe I should run a Toy Rock and Outbuild with a normal soldier lead. Well, that'd be fun. <laughs> what, Blackheart? Oh, I got 10 for some videos, so I can tell you how it works. Yeah, just <clears throat> redeem it and drop your epic in chat. Although you're a two month sub. Three months subs I had for free. Or like no channel points. 
Yeah, if you redeem it, you just drop your epic in chat and I add you. Pretty simple. Did you compare the numbers? I hope it's not a visual glitch. So it's hard to compare the numbers because before and after a war cry is really tough to... He's not good enough, in my opinion, to get really into it. That's why I'm not going to look into it further. Like, if that was a potentially viable build that I was really excited about, I would try it. But it, it was, it's just not. It's pretty clearly not going to be viable, whether it's better or worse. Having to dedicate nearly your entire loadout to Warcry cooldown reduction is not a path to success. <clears throat> and that's why I don't like Warcry. That's why I don't like Warcry Commanders. Gotta be specific about that. If you take, I think one of them, my favorite examples of Cry Hero that's just bad is the one where it decreases the Warcry energy cost. Yeah, that's nothing. It's my day's been great. Yeah. Holy Rock and I'll great Axe I'm sure it's decent. I'm running Nocturno, totally rocking out. So that when I'm saying that previous one is bad, you guys can see what I mean. Wish Rabbit wasn't Warcry guy. Rabbit Raider Jonesy? Does he have a Warcry? I actually don't know. What are you talking about, Maples? The stream? Wish Rabbit wasn't Warcry guy. Why would you not want a Warcry on Rabbit Raider Jonesy? Thank you for the prime for sub, Mr. Salmon. What? Extra damage for free, basically. Yeah. First time I subscribed to someone on Twitch. I appreciate it. And I hope not. Have you been sitting there with a Prime sub, not using it every month? Got it. Gotta give somebody that Prime sub. I'll go to waste otherwise. I mean, I'll, I'll happily take it though, if you're happy to support the channel. Because I could clear trees and stuff with something else. Are you kidding me? You want your bow to do less damage so that you can do the work of an obliterator or a cannonade or a. Discharger can clear stuff. You could use a V6 launcher for clearing stuff. You could use the thumper for clearing stuff. You have options. You have variety. I like the cannonade for clearing objects. I used to it just to get it to you. I appreciate it, Mr. Salmon. The deatomizer ninth. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh my god. That's so expensive. Maple. He's too rich Use to care. Use the Use the obliterator. Honestly, I kind of used the cannonade a little bit for clearing. It's Maple. It's 35 energy cells per shot. I they see people do that all the time. The deatomizer is a very popular crowd clearer, and I or like a building clearer, and I don't... I don't know why people do that to themselves. What can I even do as a Prime oh. sub? Well, you get 20% more channel points. You got... <clears throat> uh, subscriber emotes. You've got a badge next to your name. There's more, but I can't remember it all. Did I just stop getting wafers? What the fuck? Goodness. What was that drought? Access to the VIP Discord channels, yeah. That's true. Discord channel VIP. If you have your Twitch linked. You don't have a single upgrade explosive weapon. Why not? They're good. You guys see what I mean? Your... Oh, oh wait, happy... Discord force? Okay. Yes, please. You see, chat? That's what you can do when you actually have damage perks. Like, I'm doing more without a war cry than with it. I'm doing more in this build without a war cry than in the other build with with the war cry. Yeah, Discord perks are a big deal. 
I am very active in the VIP channels. Yep. I think I see you once, like, every day in the Discord. And if, if I'm not interacting, it's usually because someone decided that AS's quick math on an unimportant weapon was so fucking important that they were going to argue about oh. it for multiple days straight. Oh no. I won't name names, but anybody in the VIP channel knows exactly what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. I try not to get myself involved. I did not. That was a good idea. I, and I think I think it was because I did have work, so I didn't really have time for that. <laughs> that was just the least important, most heated argument I'd ever seen in there. Yeah. Yeah. I saw like the aftermath of it, and I'm like, what the hell happened? Yep. Yeah. It's not what it's not about. Let's not. I mean, let's. Uh, I think it's. And not, it was important? important. Was it though? It was quick math on the candy corn LMG. Like what? Candy corn? What was the purpose of that? I I don't know who would use the candy corn. I mean, it's a good LMG, yes, but it's only lots of physical, <laughs> which is like the only, which is the only downside that I can see with the candy. With the candy corn. What was that supposed to be? Like a crow sound? <sighs> same the problem with the. Cry. It's the same problem with the gender blaster. It's a I good hate. pistol, but it's only a lot to physical. I hate being so trash at these target practices. Or how do you cope? How do I cope? Mm hmm. Uh, I listen to music I like. Same. Anything that sounds good to me, I will put that on my Spotify playlist. Mmm, completely fixed my method of doing math, which affects many other things. Incredibly important. Mm. I just wish the discussion was more polite. Yeah. That was so weird to read. He was just on the edge of being rude the whole time without quite crossing the barrier. I didn't like it. AS took it a lot better than I would have. Yeah, it took it way better than I did. Yeah. I would, what was the specific was there. problem, AS? Oh, go ahead. Because... Like, was it a legitimate... Was this a mathematical mistake, or like an error in no. judgment? Maple asked... I read the whole thing, but I'm just... And... Because Maple and the person were having a debate, I guess, about certain things and maple asks um as for, for information and i guess as corroborated their points it was a legitimate mathematical error legitimate mm -hmm. really yeah regardless they were just being rude do you think you'll try new br no i don't like br the older I get in my years, I don't know, the more I play games, the less competing with people feels worth it. I get very competitive, and it's not worth it. It's just not worth it. I can't enjoy BR. I only go into BR for creative, and that was... And that's pretty much it. Can a human donate a movement speed baron? Well, if you're able to grow one, then yeah. <laughs> they don't grow on trees, people. That's what you think. <laughs> oh. But is there something about the humans that only you know? Well. I, I keep my secrets when they matter. I understand that. Say That's it. a problem I had in Minecraft, actually. It was often like the most knowledgeable people were the most arrogant ones. <laughs> a lot of the people I used to play Minecraft with were insufferable. I couldn't handle them. They were just so rude. Automatic experts on everything they talk about, even when it's not true. 
Peace for a second. I thought I was doing crit explosions for a sec. I was like, wait, what? Oh, yeah, no. Oh, Nocturnal. But then nuts. I realized it was just you with the Nocturno. I was like, since when did the special boy do crit, crit explosions? <laughs> what Pokemon is your profile picture? Milotic. Swamp Knight, good in Flash AC build? No. No, he's useless. Doesn't work the way you'd expect. I'm not saying the user in the Discord was insufferable. I'm saying the, the Minecraft people I used to play with were. Eh. I know those types. Yeah. This is very satisfying. See, this is what I mean. This is why I don't like Major Oswald, you know? Like, his perk is interesting, but it's like it's a lot of work for inferior damage. This just annihilates everything. Now, I know I'm using the Nocturno. Last game was mostly the Ranger, but... I did use the Nocturno a little bit and wasn't doing this. You should make a Minecraft server? Been there, done that. Especially RLCraft. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Our Minecraft server was top tier. <clears throat> Is there anything you don't like about Save the World? Do <laughs> you have 90 minutes? I don't rant I mean, as much as I used to. It's not worth yeah. it. Epic knows what I don't like, and... And they proceed to not fix it. That's not true. I gave them a lot of feedback. I specifically sent them my Worst Heroes video. And I know Magus was specifically taking notes on my video and brought a lot of that into the meeting. It's... I, I can't take full credit. I wasn't in the meetings, but I take some responsibility for... The fact that we can put minigun lefty and righty away. That was heavily lobbied by me. Epic obviously agreed. Um, I was largely responsible for grenade damage buffs. I was telling them how poorly that was handled. Um, I don't know why they buffed Rosie. and I, I think they just took like the weakest hero abilities and tried to add to them a long time ago. Um, they did a lot of stuff. I can't remember. Um... I mentioned, I mentioned in that video that there was no hero in the entire game that buffed reload speed. I was like, guys, in the previous update, or in the previous hero loadouts, or hero system, we used to have a hero that at least increased this reload speed. Then I mentioned how Chromium Ramirez used to do that, and then you patched her. And then a few months later, Chaos Agent came by, and I thought, oh, well that'll do. <laughs> yeah, he sure does. Yeah. Well that'll do, yeah, okay. Chaos Agent effectively increase how much uh, DPS we can do now with certain weapons. I do not know what kind of meeting they had. I don't know my true involvement, but I take some credit in letting Epic know, hey, we don't actually have a reload hero besides Chromium Ramirez in the lead. Who the fuck is running a commander that reloads quickly? That Nobody. Nobody does that. Nobody who knows better does that. Except on the one chance that someone's using the uh, the cleaner that doesn't even have a reload perk. I mean, but yeah. still, why would you even use her? Uh, it doesn't even matter then. <laughs> cleaner has a .3 fire rate, so even with the reload, it does nothing. You, you're, you are shooting once every three seconds maximum with that weapon. It's brutal. If they even added one reload speed perk, just one, the oh, cleaner would be a much better sniper. We all know. We know. But yeah, they do stuff like that. The rosy bubble was Matteo's idea. Straight up. He posted that on Reddit and the whole thing came to fruition. A lot of my Rosie suggestions on the Reddit post happened. I'm my suggestion was one of mine was one of the suggestions that said, hey, why does Rosie even overheat? Why does that even happen? And now it doesn't. <laughs> so, you know, it's nice to be cynical and say that Epic is a meanie meanie poo poo pants who never does anything we want, but that, that's just not true. I mean honestly. They made it so that Farah chains off of the chain lightning, and everybody's like, Whoa, this is crazy, this is overpowered, and then Epic agreed. And then we all yeah. fussed, and then they undid it. And now it's permanently in the game. 
And uh, same thing with Affliction. I said how Affliction was garbage for years and years and years and years, and then they buffed it with the same update as the Vacuum Tubo. But then they took that buff away, and then they brought it back. So now, now Affliction is permanently strong now. So, again, it's it's easy to bitch, but it, it takes a little bit of maturity and memory to highlight every time that Epic actually did exactly what we wanted. Stack size 999, crouching, sprinting, mantling. It's easy to be angry, chap, but you gotta look at the whole picture. You gotta look at the whole- I could make a list just as long of the bugs that have stayed that should be fixed, but it goes both ways. It's not all bad. Hell, we just got to change to Gordon Kyle that made him a really strong hit. And maybe that wasn't the thing everyone was thinking about, but you know what? It's a change we'll take, right? Cloak Shadow's viable now. I've been having fun with yeah, that Cloak one. Yeah, Cloak Shadow's good, too. Yeah, Cloak Are you answering more on Twitch than YouTube? Yes, yeah. always. Although, YouTube's not asking me that many questions. Although, Supim's got a few here. Does the new season mean new ventures or anything different? No, BR season is completely separate. New season to save the world means a different season of ventures, yes. But BR and Save the World are completely separated. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad they keep fixing bugs every update. Yeah. Um, okay, next venture. How are people getting a mag size of like 6 on Xenombo and do 6k damage doom hammer on this game horn? Probably bugs. Xenombo, I don't even know how you get a 6 mag size on that. <sighs> 6k damage on the horn is legit. That must take a lot of setup and RNG, otherwise everybody would do it every game. How do you even do that? Everybody runs Banshee. Wouldn't that, would that actually stack like that though? Yeah, the commander stacks. Like everybody runs Banshee and you've got... Everybody ear splitter. I mean, that's those are the best bonuses. How do you get six thousand? What about having uh, hardware damage and lead? Yeah, right. Like if your entire build is focused on hardware damage, that might work. But like, I, I if if six thousand damage was something you could set up without sacrificing an entire build to it, to the extent that it doesn't even make sense anymore, then three banshees, links, quadruple. Oh, see, it's a glitched weapon. I knew there was a catch. I knew there was a catch. He says Assassin Sarah support. Like, how are you gonna get five melee kills and then smack the horn? Like, this is silly. They both had it. The perk options were just shifted. Technically not. That is a glitched weapon. They were shifted by one, and then they fixed it. That was not supposed to happen. Really, Storm Just... God? <laughs> no, no, no. For the someone was talking about fast swapping. Oh. Oh, fast swapping. Yeah, please do not. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Stuff like that. Please don't talk about that here. Thank you. Yeah, I, I, I know what is. we were talking about. I knew you. We're aware. That's obviously a glitch to me, though. Yeah. <sighs> I'm doing ventures. I want more of my peg leg action. Yep. What do I they want? It's time that we do cloak shadow. I'm doing cloak shadow. Oh, uh, I need pickaxe kills. Nurses, flingers. Uh, let me check my quest real quick. I just assume everybody <laughs> in the party is good oh, for ventures. No. That's me, Jesus. I need to destroy fire escapes. Mm. The dread one. Wait a minute, is this Jane the Weir quest this season? Yep, yep. This is oh. a city, so you'll get all of that. I'm aware of that AS. I thought schematics like that were no longer obtainable. Like, if you open Founders Llamas, those schematics aren't shifted anymore. They had to do that? Or, like, 
I thought having six perks was the whole point of a founder's purple weapon. That still sounds like a glitch. I am central. I don't know. What about say the rule in July? Oh, regionally... Both have different birthday updates. Yeah, okay. Any schematic I got in before the change was has the old perks on it. Whatever. Whether it's a glitch or not is something I picked aside, but it's it doesn't seem like that was intended to happen. I'm just salty because I don't have the schematic. What's the schematic? Had, I had the Founders Knight Cleave, and I didn't perk it in time. The yeah, ones. me neither. It was completely useless. It's so... They were never given an item reset. I mean, how do you even tell if it's a bug, though? I'm just going off of opinion. To me, it's like... Pretty obviously... A weird thing. Why does it say my power level is... Oh, that's not that's been interesting. Oh, yeah, speaking of the four times uh, attack speed, Nightwave, I think me and Musician actually uh, got with the guy who creates them, and we did a Frost Knight run with it. I think we told you about that one time, Beast. Yeah, that's going Double checking if I have it. I'm certain I don't, but I want to know anyway. Uh, can't control F. Oh, this is a mess. Yeah, I didn't, uh, I didn't save my founder's weapons because I saw they were purple and just got rid of them. I was a little noob, so I never held on to any of them. Then they gave out extra Founders Llamas, and I don't even think I have a Night Cleave that's not glitched. I just don't have it at all. I might have never even gotten one in the first place. Yeah. Pay to win RNG. Very cool, very cool. You could recycle Founders Weapons? It was the Founders Weapons that you got from Llamas, not the ones you directly paid for. I also like that Cloak Shadow lets you take less durability on your on your peg legs. Makes oh, it last yeah, a bit longer. We got Battle Beat, nice. Er See you, Silver! Uh, I'd love some more Founders Llamas, cuz... Yeah. You know, even when I knew better, I might have recycled them anyway, because they were pretty bad. Like, none of the Founder's weapons were good for anything, yeah. I didn't value them much. And then suddenly, the perks get shifted, and you can have a quad attack speed Night Cleave. Like, what? What the fuck? Epic. Yeah. That's... that's crazy. I think it'd be... this, again, going into the shoulda, woulda, coulda, a quad for us to have. Yeah. It's... It's one of those ones where it's like, I kind of... They were always fun. Doesn't really matter, but it's annoying. Yeah. I can pay for the same pack as somebody else and they get a way better weapon out of it. Mm. Does anybody need a chest? Uh, I don't think so. Natalie, welcome. Hello, Natalie. Hello. Um, and I guess the other silver lining is that it doesn't really matter. Like, it might be the best weapon with Luna, but it's also... I mean, a lot of Luna weapons are just fine.
Hi, Aura, my love. Wow. Did I miss something? Oh. Uh, what? Uh, <laughs> is there something going on, Aura? How do I get legendary no. perk up? Run a 4x perk up mission. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'll Aura, when were first. you going to tell us? That at least fun. Yeah, nice if anyone humans. has Xenobo, can you shoot it a couple times across the city? Uh, Might want to, uh, let the, let the paint dry there a little bit, but, you know. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, I, I'm sorry. I, Natalie, you, you know, I never knew of this. I never knew that we were in a relationship. What? That's even worse. That's even Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're supposed to just pretend. Fuck, I should've oh. just pretended. Yeah, you're not right. 18 yet. N Natalie, I'm really sorry. So one-sided. Yeah, be careful the one, here. The one problem in the, in the relationship. Which ventures is more fun? <sighs> Me too. Making it fun with fun loadouts goes a long way. Yeah. I'm so ready for the Blasted Badlands to come back. So I can use that minigun build. Oh yeah, the Rage modifier. I can't, I can't wait for the superheroes uh, one to come back because you can just get left and righty instantly if you have a rocket launcher. I love that so much. I love it or, so or much. Or Xenobo. I can, I, can, I can receive your feelings. Yeah. Weird, weird how we all just love this team perk that makes our uh, hero good to the point where we can farm one hero in the lead. Yeah, equip with the infinite... Uh, uh, yeah, Dance Clip becomes her own loadout. Yeah. Yeah. You don't yep. need Archaeologist or Fossil Southie. Man, you get so many items from a target practice. Like, I do it for fun, but you really make out like a bandit. You don't need either of them in a one two punch build. What? <laughs> no, uh, for the team perk I use during that season is Long Armor the Law. That's not necessary. Oh. What? Yeah. Let's do a storm chest on me. I placed a faucet right. in my bathroom sink this evening. Feeling mildly accomplished. You should feel mildly accomplished. That was not that big of a project, but a satisfying one. I mean, hey, I felt similar the first time I ever changed up. Change what? Something so. Changing a light bulb. Mm -hmm. so. Looks like aimbot. Thank you, Natalie. See, Chad, I wish more people talked to me like that. <laughs> Just hear from an epic to Yeah, that looks like aimbot. Blows up my ego like a balloon. Thank you. Yeah. Mad just threatened to ban me for aimbot. Yeah, yeah. Bees. The account you are trying to reach no longer is. So many resources. Oh. <sighs> That's one of my main recommendations too. Storm chest, like, you know, people always talk about farming and getting resources, but storm chests and encampments, like, these things are fun, at least in my opinion. Oh, we're I not in a one. Oh, we're not in a one forty. No wonder my garden gnomes didn't count. Damn it! I actually thought this was one forty. <coughs> That's the whole reason so, I ran it. Bless you. Bless you. Okay, bless you is for sneezes, and it's based yeah. on an old <laughs> tale that thing. your soul leaves your body when you sneeze. Bless your heart. That was a cough. Oh my god! And my soul feels weird. like it's still there. Let's start the mission. I got a cleaner. My god. <laughs> Double headshot damage impact. Yeah, triple attack speed ravager is good. How much damage is this? Oh my god. Yeah, it's a fun build, right? People, you know, they ruin Blackbeard stash. No. It's plenty strong, as demonstrated. Alright, I'll get blue glow since my teammates are. There we fucking go. God damn it. 
What type of music do you like, Beast? Nightcore. If you do exclamation point good shit, you'll see what I listen to. Can you explain the loadout after the match? Blakebeard stash is good. Cloak shadow triggers shadow stance that kills everything around you. It's not a complicated build. I guess the battle beat and Luna part of it is kind of complicated, but if you just use them without question, you'll be fine. SAC. Are you looking for my support, a creator? You mean code Mista right there at the top of my overlay? Proudly on display at all times, so everybody knows the easiest way to support me in the Epic Shop. Yeah, I'm only level 72, by the way, and I'm and I'm doing a lot of damage with this build. It is just Mista, M I S T A. Are level learning? You guys are talking to each other, but I'm Max, in case anybody wanted to know. I thought you were a beast. Hmm. Yeah, everything's dying so easily. It's not even a four player. You made tiny apple pies yesterday. How tiny are we talking here? If they were Natalie's size, they gotta be like a cracker or something. Like an Oreo. <laughs> I was gonna make that joke, but you mean to it. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, no. Speaking of pies, uh, my mom for my birthday, she actually made me a pumpkin pie cheesecake and it was really delicious. Mm. That's fun. I wanted to try something different this year instead of just getting a regular cake, so. Um, you bless your friends when they burp as well. It drives me crazy when people say that. I wince anytime anybody says bless you. I just take it quietly though. They mean well. Where is that finger? There it is. Their first message ever was asking Natalie for a piece of her tiny little apple pie. All right. Uh, I, I guess I, I'm, I'm less not, interesting not, than apple pie. I saw that. Uh, hmm. What? What are you humming about? That's a, just that's just an interesting comment. That's a message. It's an apple pie. She said anything for you. Oh my god. Is that what you were humming in? Oh, uh, what the hell? I would... Natalie, are you high? What, what, what are these? Why is she <laughs> flirty today? <laughs> I have never known Natalie to be flirty in my chat. This is... I mean, she just got dumped. This is new. Did she? Did I miss something? Well, first she's calling Aura her love, then he asks for a slice of her pie, and she says anything for you. And I'm like, whoa, 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 this oh, is... <laughs> Are you reading this? This is... Uh, no, I'm gonna need you to calm down a little bit, okay? <laughs> Smoke? I have no idea. Internet providers are notoriously scandalous, so... Look at this. Even Natalie doesn't even know what's going on. Uh... <laughs> I mean, she was at like a 10. Okay, we need to drop it down to like a 2 or something. <laughs> I did not just get dumped. That's what- that's the main thing she wanted to reply to. That was the most important part of what we said. Oh... <laughs> How many hours it takes to finish all of Twine Peaks? Uh, there is no counter for that kind of thing. You can't a lot of RNG. Point. You can't speed- I, I- I mean, I guess you can't really speed run the game? I- I don't know. Yeah, tell you didn't know. It, enjoy the enjoy. What yourself else was while there? You're it. You'll have way more fun. Yeah, I know this because I just did it. Um, where did all the enemies go? What? What the hell? Uh, guys, I think we broke. I think we broke the. Uh, the Killed them dead. Ah, shit. Oh wait, no, they're spawning in now. Maples is going yeah, to Twitch. I'm recently. thinking about it. I'm done traveling. I don't. It's. I don't like it. I you miss too much. Like I'm. I really enjoy my day to day, and I don't like. I don't need vacations. I'm already living one, so I don't like getting out, flying across the well, country, I'm, I'm spending on thousands of, of dollars. Of 
I love this build. You just walk through the crowd of enemies and they all just die. Yep. I'm just holding down this area by myself with no... With no trouble. And oh, then the escalation modifier is always in full effect. You're right next to the enemies as soon as there's a burst of elemental... Oh, oh my god! Wait, was that just from the... Cloak Shadow? That was a pot alone? shot. He was right behind you. Oh. Yeah, I'm sorry. Cloak Shadow is yeah, not that good single target. Uh, I was about to say, I was like, wait, what? Yeah, I still don't know how tiny the uh, apple pies are. Wait, what? Natalie said, oh, are you, are you Twitch conning? I might, yeah. It depends. If people are interested and it becomes a thing, I might do it. Um, I mean, I'm gonna try and go. Really, like, late September. I heard that Rosa and Emerald might be going. Fun. I'm gonna try. I already met Rosa. She jumped on my bed at 6 a.m. <laughs> oh. <laughs> she really did that? She really did. She, she also did yeah. it later in the day. I thought about... I, I think I... I'm probably gonna try, but I'm going on a big trip in uh in uh at the end of April, so nobody's gonna make a rocket ship comment. Okay. Uh huh. Nothing. All right. Little Einstein's. <laughs> I let her in so she could. Yeah, yeah, I know. There See, we, we were we were expecting her in the morning, so I was kind of on high alert. I heard footsteps and just. Watched her come oh. over and then she jumped on the bed. Like a, like in a horror movie, basically. Never woke me up. I <laughs> just kind of watched it happen. Yeah, TwitchCon's like a ways away though. It's weird. Like I, I don't need to schedule it now, but be cheapest to buy tickets now. But it was really fun the first time though. So that, there's that. I I need to see the tickets for uh, San Diego go on sale. And the hard part about it, for me to justify it, is like all my favorite memories for Twitch for TwitchCon were unplanned. Like I didn't expect to meet Filza and Small Ant hanging out at a at a partner party. I didn't think the guy that I was chatting with for the first couple of days was a porn star I recognized. I didn't expect <laughs> to be in the same room as Dream. I didn't think I'd run into Amaranth twice. I didn't think I'd make friends with execs at Twitch staff. But all this shit just kind of happened, and. You, you, you just can't expect that, so... Yeah. There's a lot of value in... Yeah, when I found out that, that the friend I'd made was a porn star I'd already known about, I couldn't wait to tell her his mom. I was so excited. I found out at dinner, right next to Ray's Works, who's a friend of mine, by the way. And it just... <laughs> he and I, he, I liked his idea. He and I had been eating dinner at the partner party, so when we sat down to dinner at the hotel, he and I just got chocolate cake. <laughs> that was our dinner. Oh, yeah. Uh, we we were literally actually... at dinner. Hour. You remember that? We, we were at... We what? were meeting your mom at your hotel. He and I just yeah, had no, cake. I rem yeah, no, I remember the... I remember the... I remember the cake thing. I'm telling... I'm telling exactly what happened. About oh. The porn star thing. Because we were, like, in the midst of conversation. And then Mises has like an, oh my god, what the fuck, like kind of face, and he's like, I'm at a porn star, no, like he was flabbergasted. I knew they were like, a porn star, I just didn't know they were my genre. I did not <laughs> expect that. <laughs> I'm sorry, wait, your genre? Oh, yeah, I'm not. glad I'm not the only one who heard that, hang on. Oh my god. Um... I didn't know you actually met, uh, Vilsa. Yeah, that was cool. That was this is pretty random. I want to go meet people. Like, yeah, well, people like y'all in person. All of my fa this sounds like an asshole, but like all my favorite run-ins were in like partner areas. Yeah. At one point, I found myself. This is a Ravager video. I don't remember if this is triple attack speed. I don't think. I think this is just the whiteout Fiona side of that. But like, there was a mo there was a part where I was like, oh shit, that's that's Ludwig. Oh shit, that's SQ XQC. And then oh, there's Hassan marching around with his bodyguard. And I was like, what the fuck is happening all around me? Um, San Diego. <laughs> it's that moment where like, oh. 
<laughs> yeah, should be able to. What time do you start your stream in UK five. time? Ah, uh, eight PM UK maybe. Oh, you're definitely a wait till last minute type of guy. I don't know who she's talking to, but that's not me. I usually plan ahead. I just don't know if I want to go because I definitely had some really interesting experiences, obviously. <clears throat> but I just. I don't know. I've done enough travel in the last couple of years. It's expensive and I don't need more of it and I don't know. I need suburbs. Yeah, thank you for requesting to join and blocking my map when I have a full party. It's always appreciated. Yeah, I've been pretty relaxed on reminding people. If I have room, I will let you know. There is no need to Okay, I need suburbs. I need chimney tops, but this mission doesn't have what I need. Whatever, we'll just do retrieve the data. It's Lakeside. She is talking to me. Oh, I'm not a last minute kind of guy. Yeah, I don't think she is either. You plan a year in advance? That's too far. Oh my god. Because Twitch doesn't even have that stuff organized a year in advance yeah like you can't even buy tickets for san diego right now at least i couldn't vegas they for europe vegas they held out on information for so long that by the time my family was ready to buy stuff it was way too expensive it was like eleven hundred dollars per head to travel and we were like fuck that oh no fuck that yeah if this yeah if it's costing like eleven hundred then no per person yeah, no. When I went to TwitchCon with Sig, we... Our tickets were remarkably cheap. What were they, Sig? Like, well, I know I did Florida today for like 180 bucks, but... I remember San Diego being... Was it like 400 each? That sounds right. Probably. You're only like a couple states away from me, and I think that was around my price. It was still like 400 bucks there and back. That was not terrible. But our Airbnb was relatively cheap. I don't want to talk about my hotel price. Ooh. Most rooms are was... already booked. Yeah, like that's that's stressful. Bro's a stalker. What? Gonna know where you're going, where you're staying. Why is she telling me all this? You know, I have, uh, between last year and the year before, I think I've added, like, eight different trips to my list of things I've done on Earth. So, I'm, I'm that's my point, though. Like, I've, I've kind of, I'm good. And it, I sacrifice things to travel. It's not, like, not just money, but it's, it's time away from the girlfriend, time away from my home and creature comforts, can't really stream for that time not making videos or being productive it's just it's a lot of things that can't happen while I'm away you should visit LA and ask me yeah see I didn't want to do that the Pokemon event for a Sinnoh tour was in LA and I heard very bad reviews of L.A. from the girlfriend, and I just believed her blindly. <laughs> she didn't like L.A. Yeah, I have a lot of, like, randomly interesting friends, though, so... I, I get through some doors that... you wouldn't expect. Makes things interesting. Watch these despawn right in front of me, because I died a minute ago. Really? I'm sure they were about to, about to despawn. LA, home of car chases. Mm -hmm. Let's see some ranger action. I'm doing ventures right now. I'll get everything it'd take for me to make Twitch content out of this year and to be around five grand? What? Oh, what? How? My two week trip to Florida was like three. How would a weekend in San Diego be $5,000? California oh, no. being in an expensive hotel. Fuck that. Who is that? 
That's sick talking right now. I need to. I need to. What is advanced? Advanced CG is a yummy energy drink. It's like flavored caffeine. Airbnb for the week? Oh, you're doing a whole week. Yeah, see, that's oh, not Ultron's worth it. Here. I definitely had a good trip Ultron's in San Diego, Ultron's. but not $5,000 good. I don't like feeling like I'm on sort of a... I don't like the pressure of traveling, too. When you're spending hundreds of dollars a day in hotel and the flight to get there. I feel a lot of pressure to make the best of every day. I don't like that. I don't. That's like when I'm standing there chatting with the Ultrons and Madio and meeting them for the first time. I can't talk to anybody without thinking, gee, the amount of money I'm spending per minute to be in this conversation <laughs> is yeah. a lot. How many minutes do you have in a day? 60 times, so 1,200 would be like 1,320 or something like that? I don't know, this is just sounding like... It's like every four minutes I'm standing here, it costs me a dollar. So like every second on the TwitchCon floor, I'm like, shit, I need to move. You have 13,000. This just sounds like you're overthinking it to me. Have you met me? Got to meet. I got to meet Rosa, worth it. Yeah, Rosa was fun. Uh, that's part of it. I want to. I want to meet people. Yeah, and that's that's Plus, definitely a fun done, part of it. I've never done a con like this. They're very the very fun. Like yeah, a... I've never been to TwitchCon before, so I want to do round two this year. I. But yeah, Advanced CG. It's like flavored caffeine. It's no sugar. Good. Really, really yummy. Straight flavor. It's not like that air up thing that's getting popular where you have to sniff it and you fake it. No, Advanced CG is like actual flavor. It's delicious. Yeah, and there's also non caffeinated flavor. That's the two seconds she wasn't with you. No, we actually split up a lot. Although traveling with Aura and Donna was great because both of them had like their little disability stickers and I got to get in on that. We skipped so many lines. <laughs> I was just fine with that. Yeah. Up in like ADD. Stuff. Yeah, there you go. Well, I have, Just well, make me your uh, guardian. We'll, we'll get around. I have, yeah. <laughs> I have a disability as well, so I mean, that's that's perfect. Like three or four people, you yeah, know. Yeah, I'm just gonna collect <laughs> wheelchair travel buddies and just get around. <laughs> yeah, Between the Sig, Sig was Rose's uh, disability buddy, and then he just became mine. And I'm like, yep. well, we're kind of stuck with each other. For perfect. Me, I walked about twelve miles a day yeah. on that trip. Fucking aura. Oh, I'm I here. was surprised I'm on how much I could walk that. I, could, I was surprised on how much I could walk those days. That's what a con does to you. Hey. He was like, dang, yeah. I'm gonna be moving today. Yeah. Made me happy I'm a Pokemon player. I might stream yeah, and make right. videos for a living, but I am. I'm pretty well in shape. Razeworks was too. That surprised me. You'd think nerdy Pokemon or nerdy Minecraft YouTuber would be out of shape. No, he and I dressed the fucking same t shirts and cargo shorts. Both of us wore running shoes. He and I. Walked from the convention back to our place and had dinner. It was a super nice guy. <laughs> he was really in shape. He and I got along. We dressed the exact wow. fucking same. <laughs> and we're like on a short list of people that nobody looks like because he keeps that very private. That was kind of fun too. I keep forgetting I'm over leveled. Looks like he lives. He probably does. What's your best Pokemon you have in Pokemon Go? I have a Shundo Jirachi. Ooh. I remember when you blew up my DMs about it. Mm hmm Say Valor quest lines worth doing? All quest lines are worth doing. Um, honestly, you get gold and tickets and everything, and you're doing it on the side of your regular missions. Like, you're not going out of your way to do Valor, so you might as well. Oh. Fire um, function got me. Raise works? Yeah. So that's actually, I feel like that's one of my fun little... My version of a... YouTube childhood kind of thing. Razeworks and I met when he had like 600 subscribers and I had like a hundred. <laughs> Both doing Minecraft at the time. And because I have a very, very, very technical Minecraft background. Shocking, I know. And he and I knew each other for a long time. We were nobodies. I think I was the first person to follow him on Twitter. God damn it, I can't even stay alive. I'm just gonna ignore this encampment, this isn't worth it. I still watch even though I don't play news. Yeah, yeah, he's a fun guy too. 
So he went a different path. He went, he, he stayed on Minecraft and channels quite a bit larger because of that, but... It was really fun because he has an interesting voice. The way he sounds is very youthful, but he is... Not that. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. It was fun to meet him. It's like kind of an honor to actually know what he looks like because he had like his badge turned around as well. He did not want people to just recognize him randomly. So that was, uh, that was pretty special. He's also very polite. Yeah, he's a, he's a good guy. Just really want to make the memories. I didn't do a lot of things I wanted to do. I felt like that. I don't want to just go do the app. Yeah, I guess we're in opposite positions, Sig, you know? I actually completely understand. It, Sig's motivation and making the memories is exactly why I'm I'm kind of good. I'm so boring oh. in that way. Like, I have had some pretty cra crazy wild... I, I've had some pretty oh. crazy trips in the last couple years, and I'm... I'm chilling. Uh, yeah, Cassie, I also have a daily video series on my YouTube channel where I point out the worthwhile missions to run. Definitely worth checking in on if you're looking to... Farm up. That was a really good... Or was it yesterday? yesterday? I don't remember, actually. Look at this, chat. Look at this over. build. Look, I can just... Alright, I'm dead. Alright, so I <laughs> ran a 140... That wasn't that funny. I'm running a 144 player, and I have not yet respected how much stronger they are. Oh my god. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, oh, oh god. I, I, I was trying to collect my There chest. we go, we'll get some of that extra damage here. Thank you. Oh All fuck, right. we're both running I know one too. of these are yours, I had like three of them down here. That's what sucks, because multiple people have this perk, you can't tell- Although who's... we're capped at eight, so we can't really- We don't- we're not really- like stealing each other's, yeah. Oh good, fire affliction stops me from looting it. That makes sense. That's a good game mechanic. That's really important, actually. Because if I could actually pick up the treasure chest, then it would let me play the game and have fun. We can't oh, have that. Good. Can't have that. Oh, oh, oh god. Does it show if it's times four? Every single four-player mission is a times four mission. And it tells you when there's perk up available. God damn. Man, this mission is brutal. I think it's the acid pools. Yeah, the acid pools oh, is what this really messes us up, and also the slow, the slow biting. I think. Is there a new Avengers modifier that they're making? <laughs> what acid pools is normal? No, 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 no. Avengers. As is brought up one in chat. Backstabbing- oh yeah, that's just a tag in the game files that they found. There's gonna be a new melee modifier that's coming out. Oh, oh my- mm, I was trying to jump away from a propane, but it didn't work. Alright, I'll be back. I'm gonna go make less sexy dinner. A what? Okay. <laughs> like chat. Did you say a less sexy dinner? I'm gonna make myself some dinner. And oh, some that just sounds like really specific. You know, you wouldn't have to do that if you had Factor. You should check it out with my link. I'm plugging hard, Jet. Yeah. <laughs> Trying to get your friends to buy some. Trying to get everybody to buy some. Make the sponsor happy, make me happy. I get a kickback yeah. for every order. It's actually That's kind of true. substantial, too. Like, I get a lot. <laughs> and you get yummy food. I wouldn't take a sponsor for a bad product, so... I've actually been really happy with it, like seriously, so... I'd probably be pretty quiet about it if I didn't love my meals, but they really were good, so... I want everybody to take advantage of it while the, uh, offer lasts. Half off your first, uh, first round of meals. I love just spamming these coconuts. People act like holding eight is some massive limitation, but... I'm doing just fine. Oh, oh, oh we're oh, all flingers or hurt lobbers. I can go focus on them. I got one. Oh my god. Oh yeah, 
Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and take out the flingers and uh, lobbers. I think I just did, but definitely double check my work. <sighs> oh, that was satisfying. Ah, amazing. If you don't stand on the acid pools, you stay alive longer. Pro tip. Pro tip, everybody. Don't stand on acid pools. Just something I figured out recently. Feels like a really good tip. Thank you. Man, it's really satisfying to just stand in the middle of this and chip stuff down. Oh, uh, mini boss inbound. That extra damage goes so far. <laughs> this is so satisfying. Takes a little bit of work in a difficult mission like this, the modifier being what it is, but... Working out. And with the limited cannonballs and coconuts, it's really pointless to steal each other's chests. Oh my gosh. That's flashy. Uh, to Discord to for a game chest. I keep up with there. Some of my nervous. Absolute cesspool, holy shit. Oh, Sig, give me the details. Hop into voice, Sig. Let me hear. Yeah, come back. How much better managed is my Nerva than this random Discord? I want to hear it. Make me feel better. Look how good this build is, Chad. Even with healing death burst, everything's just kind of dying. And there's two of us with this build, too, which goes a long way. Yeah, it doesn't really feel like there's a limit. I mean, you do have to search a bit more, but honestly, even normally, you'd be searching them anyway, so... This is so satisfying. Cannonballs are so good. Down to one. Hope everyone's good. Thanks for hanging out, Mr. Salmon. Hope to see you again. I'll probably be streaming again on, like, next Wednesday. I've been really taking it easy lately. I don't normally stream this little, but I am on break, so... We still have a mini boss. Yeah, but it's very low. It's almost dead. Wow, he despawned right as I unloaded all my cannonballs. Oh, no, he's over oh, there! Man. Yeah, he tell. I don't know why, but they've been... Teleporting oh, now he's gone. Thing. Wow. As soon as I pay attention to the mini boss, he's dead before I can do anything. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. I'm just eating a cannibal, or what? Eating a coconut preemptively. <laughs> it's so hard to get out of there alive, but it's barely working. Oh, come on. I was trying to pick up a chest and then. Yeah, I really don't like calling it a coconut nerf. It's maybe technically accurate, but it's not... It implies that they it's... actually change it in some way. You can only just hold less. It's not that direct. I think it got adjusted. I think that's the correct term. I think it got adjusted. I'm curious what my damage was. Not a single trap placed. Be active in VIP chat? Yeah, I'll definitely be in there. Where's Sig? I want these details. Oh, damn. If he's typing right now, I'm mad about it. You sat inside holding the wall. Probably the only reason we completed that mission. Alright, so no more 144 players. I see that now. I did oh, progress in my quest line, though, so that counts for something. D 
Do you think Sassar or Daily Blade Crash support are better for a peg leg build? <coughs> um, all of the. Th I am typing. I have annoyances I do not control. Oh, is there a dad yelling in the background? I think that'd just be funny. I think you should hop in voice anyway. <laughs> Maybe he's trying to shake those women off him and he just can't do it. <laughs> Gotta go now. Got college in the morning. Thanks for hanging out. I think Battlebeat and Luna are good. Battlebeat swinging faster is so good for damage. And the straight up damage bonus is nuts. Paleo Luna helps activate that a lot quicker because of her bug. But Assassin Sarah, Deadly Blade Crash, they'd all be good. In this build, honestly, I feel like uh, Arlene Iza healing you would be solid. We got room for one one if anybody wants to hop in. Wait, Luna's bugged? Yeah, yeah, she... Her extra damage applies as a second kill, so you only need five kills to activate Battle Beat instead of ten. And I think that's across all um, Dino Heroes, if I'm not mistaken. I think it's Luna and Rex. Yeah, I th uh, yeah, I thought it was either all of them or just Rex and Luna. It's because they just... add extra damage based on your health. And that just counts as a second kill for some wonderful reason. Yeah, and I think it's been bugged like day one, I think. And That's why I talk about really... it. Because it's been that way for years now. Like, obviously Epic either didn't know or doesn't care. I don't know, but... Got room for one chat if anybody wants to hop in. Beast, I have a question quickly before I go. Pokemon red, blue, or yellow? Uh, platinum. Platinum, yep. Platinum is my favorite uh, Pokemon game. I've been playing Sword. Kind of sucks. Seems like it's meant to be fun, but the fights are so easy, I'm falling asleep playing it. Arceus is kind of fun. Diamond, Brilliant Diamond was great. I loved that. That was like everything I loved about Diamond and then improved immensely. Sam, and I thought you were going to bed. <laughs> Just switch us up on us at the last second. Also, I meant team for Pokemon Go. How was I supposed to guess then? Blue. Sword and Shield made you make you guilty. A guilty ha I don't know what that means. <clears throat> I just, I just hope that the Gen 5 remakes will be a lot better than Diamond and Pearl remakes. I love the Diamond and Pearl remakes. I know a lot of people didn't like them, and I don't care. Well, All I right. did. Doing I did, but there was just some glaring issues with them. Like what? Uh, just like all the bugs and stuff. And, uh... What bugs? Some of the, uh... uh like the infinite void thing, I, I I guess it was kind of a callback to the OG ones, but still. In Brilliant Diamond, I encountered no bugs in 90 hours of gameplay. Nothing that impacted I gameplay. It, I think it was just day one of Might have been. Diamond Pro remakes. I was years late. Sam, and if you are yeah. on my friends list, hop in. Y'all grinding ventures. I don't feel like I'm grinding anything. I'm playing ventures. This is not some slog to get through it. I'm not suffering here. I'm actually having fun with this loadout, you know? Love Lovers are gone. Yeah, I didn't even notice until now. Yeah, love. I, I noticed that the bees were back. That's terrible, Sig. Then just full-on pornographic conversations in general chat. I don't see a problem with that. Talking shit with each other, I do see a problem with it, though. Uh, you know, our hangout used to have porn in it. People I, just openly discuss stuff. But then... 99 Ranger, if anyone wants it. <laughs> and our server got a little too big, and we had to squirrel the porn away into a quiet channel. Sad. I should be getting my melee kills. There we go. Yeah. Oh, that's so funny. Oh, wait. Is Pickaxe 140 plus? Am I being dumb right now? It sure is. All right, whatever. Do it later. I mean, all you have to really do is just tag them. Yeah, I know, Sig. 
full-on pornographic conversations is funny when there's 80 of you, but if it's 47,000 people, I doubt there's any coherence to that discussion. Not on my friends list. Well, you gotta be on my friends list then. Something to work towards. Okay, back to what I was saying about having problems with Diamond Pearl remakes. Yeah, but... tell me why a game I loved I sh should should be lessened in my memory. <laughs> Convince me that it wasn't as great as I experienced. Well, I kind of, I kind of like, I kind of went off a little bit too much, and I, they weren't as bad as I thought they were. Okay. But just the art style, it kind of threw me that. off a little bit. But, but like, I, I grown to love it over time, so. He's folding shit. <laughs> Archer told me that, like, other Pokemon games had led people to expect more or something, but I didn't want more. Honestly, it was everything I liked about the games, and the, the core feeling was still respected. They didn't add a bunch of shit that lessened it. The Grand Underground was a vast improvement to the old Underground. Yeah, I, think, I loved yeah. that. I spent a lot of time down there. I just liked it. I liked it a lot. It was everything I, I loved about it. Pro the better. I just wish the only thing that they brought back though was the uh, was the Battle Tower, but I, I knew it was a Platinum exclusive. And I didn't do anything in the end game, so I, I never even saw that. I actually stopped after the Pokemon League. Technically, I haven't finished that game. Yeah, there's. I think there's a lot of stuff that you can do in Platinum, like post game stuff. I don't know why they didn't do a Platinum. You know, you know what's funny? The other day I went to like some, uh, some like old fantasy store or something, and they had a Heart Gold and Soul, Heart Gold uh, copy, DS copy, and it was like three hundred, like something dollars. I was like, what the hell? Yeah, I heard Pokemon Emerald is really expensive now. Why would you spend that much on the game? It. Yeah. <laughs> That's just buy just one of those like it. TikTok like uh, emulator like, Game Boy type things and just. <laughs> Man, when you're in a lower level, you can really experience this perk to all of its glory. No, you can yeah. just install it on your computer or use it on your phone. Well, that's what people do, but the the real copies of uh, Emerald, stuff like that, the little games are yeah really coveted. I, I think the only like legitimate copy I have is uh like Pokemon Silver for the Game Boy. I don't blame you for pirating because they don't make the copies anymore. There's a finite supply of Pokemon games out there. Yeah, it's like... They don't make them anymore, so it's just completely yeah. fun to do it. Like, people are like, Oh, you shouldn't use emulators, it's pirating. And I'm like... And we're just like, they don't make it anymore, so... And we want to play it, so... They don't even make the consoles yeah. anymore, either. Like, oh, we're, you're gonna pirate the game, oh no. Stream lag looks good to me. You're gonna... Pirate the nearly 20 year old game. You made your point. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think anybody's arguing you right now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I just realized, uh, I think Fire Red and Leaf Green are gonna be, uh, I think they're gonna be like. Oh, wait, no. Did Emerald come out in 2004? No idea. I don't know. I just played them, I wasn't I'll paying attention. Up. I'll look it up in a minute, but I think I think Emerald's gonna be 20 years old this year. I have a free internet browser that's not being used right now. Hang on. If only there was a way to find out. Man. Yeah, I'm gonna look that up. Pokemon. Breaking the weather time. Yeah, right. Like a lot of those old copies. Like I know my battery has run dry on my copy, so. September 16th, 2004. Oh, nice. Oh, I was right. But yeah. the North, but that's the Japan release date. In uh, North America, it was released on May 1st, 2005. Oh, so, I mean, technically, it's going to be 20 years old this year. Yeah. Technically. Yeah, musician. Join VC. Musician. I have. <laughs> nah. Old dead topic, but I really have no understanding of why these old games are not on the Switch anymore. I just feel like it's easy money. Like, why are they not available for purchase? I don't... Yeah. 
get it. These are incredibly I mean, popular games that they don't need to program. They just need to port them over, which has to be easier than a new game and plenty worth it. I would rebuy those games at full fucking price. I'd bitch about it, but I'd probably do it just to have it on the Switch. I did I did hear that uh, Nintendo's probably going to uh, port over the old Pokemon games to the Switch. Believe it when I see it. Yeah. Maybe it's the Switch too, because, you know, they needed that new hardware just so they could finally run it. As we know, those those old games are really heavyweight. I remember Archer saying that the emulators that they use for the Switch are dog shit. That's why PC is better. <laughs> I'm sure the Avocado will not be... Yeah, me too. Nobody knows these... The live-action actors yet. We've seen them in one thing. They're all child actors that... Mm, didn't impress me anyway. I'm not gonna pick on them, but... I was not impressed with the acting in that show. I mean, the dialogue was so stiff anyway. Did anybody here watch the live-action Avatar? No, I, I haven't yet. It was... It was not... What I would call bad. It was what you would hope for visually. But... It was... Not well written. Did you look at the MCU thing? I was not... Focused when you sent me that. I opened it and then forgot about it. But I did generally see what that was. Somebody cut together all of the scenes of the MCU in a like a timeline accurate way. And it's like a 60 hour single movie of everything in order. Oh my, oh my god. Is that right, Sig? Did they like reorder every flashback and everything and just just went nuts with it? That's, that's what I got. I, I only glanced at it. Like I said, he sent it to me when I was not focused and ready to read the whole thing. Like, I woke up to that message and wasn't feeling good this morning, so I just never got the details. Why are two people healing this person? I hate it when I just see that. I hate it so much. Whenever I go to heal somebody and somebody else starts healing that person, I'm just screaming internally. Like, why, 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 why are we wasting two people on one, one task? I think not sure about, ha not sure about flashbacks. Sacred timeline order according to the official timeline book. Yeah, so it's not like watching the movies in the order. It's it's every fucking scene. I should read his message before I start saying nonsense. I'll just keep saying it wrong until he corrects me in a paraphrased version of what he sent me. I'm just glad that the uh, live action didn't follow the route of the mo of that terrible movie. Guys, it happened even like people two people healing happened before the BR thing even. Hello, Stig. Oh, Hello, finally. I, I misinformationed him into the chat. I thought I thought for a second musician joined. All right, never mind. Sig's not talking. So, oh. The Infinity Saga is what it's called, right? And it is an entire, like all of the entire universe, all in chronological order. That includes all the stuff on Disney Plus, all the IMAX versions with their deleted scenes and extended cuts and so and so on and so forth. All the Marvel or uh, the Marvel one shots, like uh, everything, they cut together as much as humanly possible. So that it was all from the very beginning to the very end in the actual order that it happened according to the timeline. So it's like 60 hours of footage all cut together in the proper quote unquote order. Wow. According to the thing. Are these movies or those shows? Everything. <coughs> from Iron Man in 2008 to Endgame in 2019. It includes all the TV shows, everything. Wow. In in the quote unquote proper order according to the official timeline book. 
sounds like a worthwhile use of an editor's time. Oh my God. If you if you just open it up and look at the first like five minutes of it, it explains the whole thing, and it's just like holy, yeah, I don't have enough time for this. Yeah, I'd want to watch the whole thing in one day. Yeah, but it's sixty hours, so good luck with that. <laughs> I'll watch it on two times speed. Yep. That way I'll finish it in one day. Mm -hmm. Okay, AJ, I'm it's not scary. sure what you're saying. What do you mean, think fast? Are you... Are you? Is this a question? I think they're asking you for the funnest loadout, which Here's I Here's 150 the of them. Enjoy. Yeah, we got room for one. <laughs> if anybody wants to join. Oh, Poplio is in here now. Okay, he knows. Apparently, funnest is actually a word now, and I'm distraught. I'm sorry that you have to be. I thought it said funniest. Days. When I was a kid, I always felt like it seems right, but feels so wrong. And now they're just folding well, and making it real. Yeah, they've they've added it to the dictionary because you know you have newest and oldest and things like that. So any kind of 124 Zaku cat for there we go. Because it sounds fucking stupid. Wow, oh, Sig, so mean. Oh, well, we gotta get 40 blue gold, gentlemen. So, hope you're ready. <laughs> we got room for one. Anybody on my friends list, if you wanna hop in. I don't care, I don't care if you're level one. We're three manning right now, so... Get in here. But yeah, as far as the, the TwitchCon thing goes, I was looking at the possibility of going, like, two days before and staying for, like, two days after. Mm-hmm. Because I didn't want to rush the whole visit San Diego thing, you know. Like last time, it was kind of like we dropped in, fucking did the con, and then fucking hauled ass, you know. I don't like that kind of trip. Like, I'd like to be able to actually hang out for a little while and get comfortable and enjoy the city a little bit. Yeah, I, I was talking to sister about where we've traveled, and she's like, "Oh, you've been to San Diego," and I was like, eh, "Technically, we've been to the convention center." Yeah, I was. <laughs> I was in, in San Diego. <laughs> I walked all nine miles to a zoo, and then... That was the most exploring we really got in the city. I'm sorry about that, by the way. Oh, Beast and I had a great time. No, but he should be sorry. That was Aww. a disaster. Yeah, well, no, what he should be sorry about is the fucking maps he was trying to send us. I appreciated it. It's just that he needed more maps. He sent me Pokemon Go maps. I... Pokemon Go maps are not maps. I don't give a shit. I was extremely stressed out. You do <laughs> you. not know how stressed out you I were, was. I you don't. Were standing in a zoo. <laughs> I had my mom breathing down my neck. You should have made her help you get the right map. <laughs> yeah, or his mom. No, no. She, she was, was fine. Not technically smart. What? She was fine. She's a nice lady. Hey guys, I'm gonna be hopping out a call for the night. Okay. I'll see y'all right. later. Take care. So, later. And I did know the area. I could see the part of the map he was circling. I just needed more information than that. Send up a flare or something. Jesus. No. I, put, I think you fine. put a lure module on or something. We we had a fun time just exploring, trying to find where you were anyway. So. Yeah, the main, so the main reason my mom was breathing on my neck about it because... We had, we did not have good service. Mm. So, she was trying to call, she, she was trying to call a car so that she could get back to the hotel, but she was getting no service, and she was getting really stressed out because it's not an area we're familiar with. So I'm like, okay, I'm trying to communicate with them. We I have found that them. panicking and raising blood pressure and heart rate improves thinking immensely. Like, the more worried and panicked you get, the better things go. God damn it. <laughs> it was fun when I got hacked at the girlfriend's place, because I was... I was all business. It was weird. It's like my whole brain just focused in on the task at hand, and it was... It was kind of fun. I, I don't know, I felt proud of myself. I was like, you know what, wow, I, I react to a very stressful situation very well. Okay. I'm learning you that now. I'm learning that right now. I did find out just the other night while I was looking around at Airbnbs and stuff in San Diego, is that 
there are multiple locations that are different prices that show exactly the same pictures. And I know they're hmm. not all the same place. Sorry, I can't have sex with you right now. I gotta go fetch back. I mean... Yeah. Kind of it's accurate. exactly what it was. Yeah. Oh my god. Wasn't even the funniest part of the night. But those who watched the video know what I'm talking about. It was yeah, after the hat. That happened. Like, Alright, so, back to it. <laughs> no, it took an hour. It took an hour of winding down, relaxing. The moment. Oh, so you wanna fuck? The moment. The moment got back to it. I got another message about an unrelated stressful matter. I couldn't fucking believe it. Batteries, duct tape, rotini gizmo. That was so fucking... I just started laughing. I just started laughing, because at a certain point, it's just funny. Duct tape, rotating gizmo, batteries! That was 40 batteries, by the way. Duct tape, rotating gizmo, batteries. All right, that's all accounted for. Can't multitask? I am an excellent multitasker, but, um... I... Those two tasks were contradictory, unfortunately. I, you know, I would be really amused. I, I've never seen this kind of thing before. Like a non-streamer tries to stream. I'm talking all five monitors, both chats open, playing the game, keeping a conversation going, handling donation alerts when they come in, answering texts from people that aren't part of the stream. Like, I'd love to see how somebody unprepared handles that. Because, you know, anybody can fire up their game and go live. It's really, really, really easy to stream. But to do it well, with a decent sized audience and keep it all going, it's kind of interesting to see. I can not hold a conversation to save my life. See how somebody might <laughs> hold that up. Hold up with that. We should do a show. Ugh. I don't want to, that sounds, uh. mm -hmm. <laughs> Show six, three, pick three, but for what? Like, me versus you right now, randomly? No, thank you. Yeah, I, there are a lot of times that I'm really glad I'm a Pokemon player when it came to marching across San Diego or that convention hall, dude. Holy shit. My phone doesn't even track that well. Like, I know it tracks Pokemon Go ineffectively. And I still... I still got 50 kilometers that weekend. I must have walked a lot of miles. I know you're impressed with how well I held up. Sig did not hold me back like I thought he would. I was surprised how little I needed to rest. Sig only cried a little bit. It was really impressive. It was a very small amount. Almost none. Basically, I had to pull him out of the apartment when we realized that nobody had eaten the Doritos. Sig, it'll be okay. We have that at home. What are you talking about? The Doritos. About we never we ate were, them. When we were leaving? Yeah. Yeah, I was disappointed about that. I wasn't. <laughs> I bet I, 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 I could have ate them all before we got to the airport. That would not just have saying. been good for anything. I'm just saying. Don't need to just... Oh, yeah, I'm supposed to be getting blue glow. Forgot about blue glow. Why are people not grabbing blue glow? Didn't somebody need 40? Uh, I did. So what are you doing? Sorry, I just, I just been distracted. You're apologizing to me about not doing your quest. Yeah, there was another unexpected upside to having Rosa living nearby, though. Was it that at the end of it, whatever groceries I had, I could be like, here, you take these with me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and she'd be like, okay, oh, I, I, guys... ha I have husband and child at home. They will eat. I thought you just left it at the Airbnb. Me too. A couple of things, but not, not most of it. Oh, that's where I get it mixed up. I'm just sort of running around the map. <laughs> I'm just having fun yeah. killing stuff. It's nice to get the ball yeah, rolling because... 
It's nice to get the ball rolling because this build takes no weapon durability, infinitely renewable. You can just keep killing. And I forgot that I need chimneys. Come on. Oh, there we go. Thank God I grabbed it before that B. <clears throat> You've never seen that, but I'm sure you have. <sighs> um, so, you know where we crossed the, the train tracks every time we went to the, the convention center? Yeah. Yeah. If you go further up toward the uh, place we had barbecue. Okay. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. There's a there's a, like a little triangular park over that way, and the Airbnb has like a listing right next to that park that was actually a good price and everything. And I was just like, oh, this is that's probably a good one, you know, whatever. And I started looking at it, and I was like, I can see views out the window from the pictures in in the Airbnb. And I'm looking at those views, and I'm like, how come I don't see the convention center at all? So I started looking around in the city on Google Maps and found the place. It's on the other side of the baseball park where they had the concert. Oh, shit. Like, it's, it's like, back behind the baseball field. We have to cross water. No. Wait, what? It's on... It's the target field the, the baseball field where we went to the concert oh over there that's not close yeah it was behind that on the other side of it from the convention center i was like that's like 12 blocks away from where it's advertised quote unquote at least what the fuck that's so that's kind of weird so, so shady for them to you know present it as oh yeah it's right here so close and it's actually like a, a mile and a half <clears throat> walk to get to the convention center. That could be close, depending on frame of reference. Well, I, mean, I, I wouldn't mind a mile and a half walk if I knew I was going to have a mile and a half walk. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. But if I'm paying for the location, mm -hmm. and the location turns out to be a mile and a half further away than I thought, that's bullshit. Bees could have done it. He's a Pokemon player. That's true. I mean, All right. That wasn't the point. <laughs> the point is, is how much money it costs. Yeah, I don't know. I'm... I'm kind of just hanging on everybody around me. Parents, say, online friends. Like, I don't... I am not self-motivated to go to TwitchCon this year. It'll well, just... Like I said, it, it, you know, it's, it's more about the making memories for me than anything. Yeah. So if there's strong external pressure, I'll go. I just don't think I need to. I don't know. It's kind of really don't like traveling. I found I'm not that kind of person. <laughs> I I don't do touristy stuff. I'm not crazy interested in the city. I don't get that excited about things. I have a good time. I don't regret any of my trips. It's just, uh... It's a lot of stress for something that's not... I, I feel like I've had a lot of that, though. Between the Pokemon Go events, and going to Vegas with the lady, and... Florida for two weeks, twice. I'm good. I've done the things... I wanted to do... for now. But TwitchCon was fun, and doing it again is, uh, not off the table. I just need motivation. Yeah, I don't even remember the actual price of the tickets. <laughs> that uh, was the I cheapest part. Like... We had dinners that were more expensive than the tickets. Mm. I thought the tickets were like 300 bucks. 250. Well, you know, mine was like... like 200. Mine was like 100, because, you know, partner, but, uh, the rest of you... Okay, buddy. I'm gonna start this. But yeah, the the place that I I did find that I think would be the one that I would get if I was to get an Airbnb and do the whole thing and nobody else was going or whatever is like seventeen hundred dollars for the week, which is like two hundred and four dollars a night. Wait, what happened to five grand? Well, 
get oh, that's... five grand to cover TwitchCon tickets, food and stuff while I'm there, Airbnb cost. I see. Fucking the flight, everything. Just yeah. to, uh, have five grand total to cover the whole, whole everything. So I I talked about this at length with the lady when I was trying to figure out my trips, and I feel like between missing her and missing home, missing my creature comforts, you know, my own shower kind of thing, I feel like in a lot of my trips, I kind of broke even. Like, I had a good time. It was worth it, but barely. You know? Like, I had to give up so much that I enjoyed it today to experience this that I don't... I don't know how worth it this was. It's not a good feeling. I don't want to spend three grand to... Yeah break even. I want to love it. Yeah. I want to have so much fucking fun, I can't wait to do it again. Not be like, eh, that was a good memory. I'll definitely get some good stories out of that. And I did. Part of the stress, I regret no trips. Part of the stress for me also was that I was having to rush to get there from the job, and then rush to get back to the job. And, you know, knowing how much money I wasn't making yeah. at the job, because I was on the, on the trip along with the money I spent on the trip, you know. Nice so maples. Just, you know, yeah. I I had to leave on the last day of the on the night of the last day because uh, my mom had a puncture literally the next day. I'm like, well, yeah, scheduling around work can really suck. That happened with the lady. We got back from Vegas and she went back to work the next fucking day. Like that's just that. Oh my god, I feel choked just listening to that. I'm glad my boss is pretty cool about it. But yeah, I, um... It's weird. I can't think of many trips that I absolutely loved, would totally do it. And like I said, most of my favorite memories of TwitchCon were unplanned anomalies. Things I couldn't possibly expect to repeat. And I just don't know. Getting a free copy of... Cyberpunk 77 was pretty cool. 2077. Even though the game was a buggy mess and I only played it for two hours. I was gonna say, have you played it at all since I then? tried it. It was just like, wow, this is not okay. Getting T-poses in the fucking intro, I was like, Jesus, alright. What? Literally. I I'm, thought this I'm is saying dumb. within the past, like, six months or so. Not at all. Have there been updates? It's, no, it's a lot better. It's, it's fully playable. It's great. Well... Yeah, it's, it's it, yeah. AS said it. It's basically a fixed game. Really? There might be minor bugs, but yeah, it is actually fully playable. It's good. Well, as long as the cave system's okay, maybe the minor bugs can make up for it. I hear you. Well, that's kind of cool. Cause I met their PR manager for CD Projekt Red, and he just gave me a key. Which actually is a really good deal for them. A key for them is basically free, and giving a partnered streamer access to your game means I might stream it one day. Although, if I streamed it, then I wouldn't be able to look at the naked lady in the hot tub. And that was... that was a nice part of it. Actually, no. That was a... that was a... That was a tub, wasn't it? She was dead. Okay, so that wasn't as fun, but... I'd have to... how do you censor that stuff? How do you play that game on stream? There's like actual nudity. Probably a setting for it. Yeah, I think it has a streamer mode setting. Anyway, it's just, uh... Seems like a really cool game. I just have been disappointed by it twice. The release was disappointing, and then when I tried to play it, it was disappointing, and now I just forgot it existed until now. Hmm. But it's still there! Still... Still installed on Steam. Could check it out. Maybe it's a good game. <sighs> Is there a video on how to deal with Chrome Husky? Yeah, I made a video on it. One of my recent uploads. Easy to find. I recently figured out that peg legs actually can kill the chrome huskies and the cannonballs. On the first try. Eventually, yeah, maybe, but it's not gonna kill him right away. I gotta go. Oh. Oh, alright. Robbie's dead. Bye bye, Sig. Yeah, anything can kill a chrome husk, but they'll have to do it several times. I. Here, let me try and find one real quick to see if, uh. That'll work. I didn't make a command for the Chrome Husk video. It's just one of the recent uploads on YouTube. Super easy to find. Left to download stuff faster. What are you, in the woods? Oh, you were complaining about your internet earlier. I hope that gets sorted. There's usually nothing you can do. 
If you call the internet company and say, hey, oh, my internet's slow, they'll just laugh at you and hang up. Or an IT person will respectfully say they can't do anything. Oh, yeah, you're right. Hey! Yeah. Welcome, Grasshopper and friends. Oh, welcome. We're uh, checking out this ruined team perk called Lakebeard Stash. And finding out that it's perfectly fine. <laughs> I haven't read a lot of angry comments about that recently. I th I'm just gonna blindly assume that most people are on the same page now that Bleakbeard's Dash is still good. No, there's not much difference. That's alright. <coughs> this mission has like no enemies though. I mean, there was some earlier, but I think it's. I think they're just coming in now. Someone's on the computer upstairs, but they weren't on it when I checked. That's funny, Smoke. So did your internet go back to normal then? Because that can happen if somebody's doing a big download. This build is so satisfying. There's actually enemies over here, so I get to enjoy it. It's like, look, Cloak Shadow is doing so much extra damage. Oh my god. Yeah, I just let... I, I decided to stop attacking, let it do the work, and yeah, it just killed a lot of enemies. I just killed a shielder, and the propane died from Cloak Shadow. So satisfying. I love that. You just walk through the crowd, and everybody just sort of dies. It's a really beautiful perk. Fun ability, I like it. I don't think this is something that you can do in the 160s. I think this is strictly for ventures, I think. Oh, it's not an endgame thing, not at all. Yeah. <laughs> but you spend so much adventures in lower level missions that it's fine. And the escalation modifier think... goes a long way. Yeah. I think the I think the apex of this uh of this uh, build was in that 140 uh, four player we did earlier. You doing ventures now? I'm doing ventures right now, yeah. You're still alive? Yep, the whole plan was to do an eight hour stream. We're getting close to that. I'm almost out of here. I get to clock out soon. That was a lot easier than I thought. Oh, that was easy. Yeah. Okay, Jay. Still did more damage than Zaku. What the fuck? The level one who had not played Ventures yet. Zaku, what were you doing? How much time was it? Well, I usually end in about 47 minutes. Ever white. I haven't made dinner yet. What are you fasting? <laughs> I mean, I'm not really that hungry right now. I'm a constructor. Mm-hmm. I didn't see a base down on that last one. Uh, Lazy constructor. Base down earlier. All right. I'm not really doing my ventures quests. We're not high enough for that. I still need two more flingers. Damn it. And chimneys. Hmm. Shoot adventures, but I don't have the patience for doing it every couple of months. You don't really need patience. With a fun build like this, it's not too bad. Just chip away at it. Uh, we can do any mission now. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. Eliminate yeah. and collect is easy. Perfect. What's the loadout for now? I've been really liking this Cloak Shadow build. I've just been spamming it. Cloak Shadow Blakebeard Stash. 
Battle Beach Serene. Serene Claws. It's so, you got, so easy. You got me addicted to that build. Kai, my next planned stream is just every Wednesday at this point. I'm on break right now, but that could change. I might get inspired and go live. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, it's the same one, Smoke. I've been having fun doing 100% uh, Tears of the Kingdom, and I'm... Just feeling good. Wow. I feel really good. Drinking my VNCG peach mango. And Ooh, yeah. I get I'm having this mentality right now. So I'm feeling really warm and fuzzy, thinking like the idea of finishing the stream soon, it's like oh it's like it's like uh it's nice and warm outside. And I get to go back outside soon. That's how it feels in my mind right now, thinking, oh, I did the big Fortnite stream. We're almost at the end. I could stop now and it'd be a good day. I'm not gonna. It's like, oh, yeah. I get to play Tears of the Kingdom right now. I got shit to do. I got a golden horse in the Heber region that's waiting for me. I got a Gleok to kill. we would be flurry rushing with a royal broadsword soon enough. I just went to the object map today and parsed out all the different shadowy statues that give you knight's broadswords and royal broadswords. Double checking the route that I made when I was playing on the Switch. You literally sound like me whenever I'm playing Batman Arkham Knight. Mm -hmm, like, mm -hmm. like those objectives in my head. Like, mm -hmm. that's literally what I was like. And I planned 100% the game, so it's not about what I'm going to do, it's about when I'm going to do it and what order. And... Yeah, yeah, that's the funny thing. I try. I really I'm gonna good. try 100%ing uh, Arkham Knight, but I just don't know when. And I got other games on the side that I want to play. So it's so nice to be busy with one game and you got plans for another. It's like you already know where you're going when you're done with this one. Yeah. It's like as soon as you're in between games, boom, Batman Arkham Knight. Game time. <laughs> yeah, like. No? I almost didn't do my 160s for last week because I was just so distracted by Arkham Knight and other games. Yeah. And honestly, like, I don't even need to do this weekly stream. Like, financially, channel growth, whatever, people could donate zero dollars and I'd have no sponsor and it's still... I just like keeping up with Save the World a little bit. I like to just, for my own sake, keep that going. And so it feels good to show up today, take care of some ventures, get my 160s done, keep up on the weapon superchargers, and then then hop back into the Tears of the Kingdom land. Yeah, I took so a ramp, I took like a, a big hiatus like last year or something like that, and I told myself, no, I'm not going to do that again. Like, I'm just going to keep up with the game as much as I could. I like to do this, by the way, just break the peg leg before I open that next treasure chest. If the peg leg I'm currently holding is in the red, might as well swap it out if I know I'm full. Yeah, that's what I usually do. Whenever my weapons get low on durability, I just recycle it and then make a new one. Maybe this can serve as a pro tip to everybody in chat, but I did not realize, I did not know how many chimneys were in the industrial zone. I got more from this mission than all of the suburbs we've been doing. Wow. Pro tip, everybody. No. Oh. Uh, I didn't realize I got a siege breaker from that uh from that awards thing. Uh not bad perks, but it could be better. Uh industry really lost its exhaust, so it's sense in hindsight. Yeah, honestly, like an industrial zone would have a lot of look at the damage, chat. I'm not even swinging. I'm not even swinging. I'm a what little behind, the hell? so I need to. Yeah, oh my not god. Not even swinging. Not even swinging. I mean, I swung a little bit at the end there, but you get, you get my point, chat. Like, this is just so satisfying. I have a very good Clax, and it can honestly go pretty well with this build as well. But yeah, I, I get really obsessed with games. That should probably surprise everybody. And, you know, it's the same reason I know everything I do about Save the World. Like, when I get really into a game, I get really into it. I learn all the things, and I, that's not different with Tears of the Kingdom. It might not be a game I make videos on, but I am... 
Well, well educated. I get really, really into it. And gonna be lurking now. No problem. I think that's literally what everyone thinks whenever they like start getting. Thank you for the raid, Grasshopper. Like, hefty game. Like with me, for example, I I discovered Warcraft, and I got really into the game. Even though it's really difficult, I I try to like you know educate myself on it a lot. Yeah, it's fun. All right, I've been apparently terrible at chat. Um, how do you get all your survivors traps? Or yeah, you just look for legendary survivors and keep the trap door ability ones. That's how you kill a smasher real fast. And then the treasure chest brought me right back up to eight coconut or eight cannonballs. <laughs> just unload your cannonballs. Honestly, whenever you're at eight cannonballs, force. you should make it a habit to just throw all the way down to seven or four or two or three. Like, just get that number low because cannonballs do good damage. And look, this is a smasher. Imagine if they had like Jabberwocky type damage, then yeah, that would be they a do. Game well, game. not Jabberwocky damage, but they explode four times. That's what just happened now. I threw not the one smasher, but the la two smashers ago, I it was kind of up against this wall here and I. Through four, and it did pretty mediocre damage, I'll admit. And then they, the the extra cannonballs exploded. <laughs> and then they exploded. And his health went away very quickly. It was very satisfying. Explosions. Second. Oh my god. Yeah, honestly, does he? Like right now. Was... Sorry to cut you off, but I just, I just blew up a, a miss monster and the explosion knocked it back into the other three explosions and then died in one cannonball. You're all good. It's a strong build. Very fun. But so burnt out of the game, I'm just now coming back. Where are the venture modifiers? Every 30 kills, you get an explosive elemental burst. I have not gotten a... I got a porter for it. I haven't had these in a while. Yeah, they're surprisingly rare. Yeah. I remember these things back in, like, OG, like, Season 4 t days. I remember port of forts being new. To hear that they're OG now is just... weird. Oh. Fuck yeah, kind of weird. Fuck you old. Oh, welcome back, Aura. A bit of using? Uh, Cloak Shadow Lead, Blakebeard Stash Team Perk. And the two, you can... you can use anything, really, but... Luna and a Wildcat are good. Yeah, Luna Battle Beat is a really nice combo because of a glitch. <laughs> God, just acid pools are just really kicking yeah, my ass right now. You gotta stay out of them. You know. I know, but that aggressive play style is just getting to me. Shadow Stance like, wanna... gives you armor, but it doesn't feel like much. 60 armor. 60 armor with Shadow Stance, but it doesn't feel like it. Yeah. I feel like if you don't want the extra damage from Luna, I think Iza might be a good replacement. Well, you're getting 60 armor from Shadow Stance. Iza would be a diminishing return at that point. You might want Arlene. Oh, you mean Arlene Iza? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Iza. there are a lot of yeah, Ar melee Arlene relevant Izas. Izas. <laughs> yeah, I, I should have been more specific. My bad. <laughs> Arlene Iza might actually do something for you. Oh look, Smasher or in the corner. Or if you want more armor, then, then, uh, Prehistoric Giza. I'll do a target practice, actually. Yeah, it's weird. I, instead of coconuts, I tried using uh, Arlene with, uh, Pip, with, uh, Assassin's Sarah in the lead. With Blast the Pass, and... You wouldn't notice it without, it yeah, I well. know. I think the reason I haven't been noticing it, um, thanks for hanging out, Lopez. I think the reason I haven't been noticing the armor is because I'm standing in acid pools, storm, enemies attacking me, barely surviving. But without armor, I'd be dead already. Remember <clears throat> the Port of Fortress? Yes. So many good resources every time. Why not just recycle all your old weapons? For what? So I can craft more peg legs? Why do I keep getting various level peg legs? I don't understand how that works. Yeah, I know they nerfed the uh, the level cap of them, but... 
I mean, just make it like one power level for like each zone. How are we at? So I got a few kills. One peg leg, one twenty-seven. How are we at so few kills? Uh, you guys just been AFK? We get more Avengers XP if we get more kills. I'm trying to find enemies. Uh, they're just too busy breaking out of the building. Why are there two enemies in one spot? Or two teammates? I need to get out of here. Oh, there's a big group of enemies right here. I don't think we're gonna get 500. Uh, it might be close. Oh, oh, oh wow. Oh, one more kill. Okay. Oh, my Everybody God. kicked it into gear. There we go. By. Damn. Took us nine minutes to get 400 kills and then one minute to get 100. 300k? Yeah, that's true. I don't have a lot of health. Oh. <sighs> I just like using this build. Unfortunately with Ventures though, because you can't craft your own weapons, you're kind of stuck with a build like this. If I wanted to switch to something else, I don't even know what I would do. Like a tower. Prickly patroller build? What? Hmm. Oh, well, yeah, what I would use on, uh, as an alternative. Can I add you? If you do exclamation point, add me, you'll see it. Hey, Seven, thank you for the, the super like. Or super chat. Super sticker. I got there in the end. Oh, I know what you meant. The YouTube. I was like, what? Since when did they add that to Twitch? <laughs> no, no, no. All right. What are we doing now? Oh, there's an encampment. <clears throat> Death bomb nature. Fun. Let's do it. <coughs> Let's do it. This has no okay. Oh. Are your mythic pistol and AR physical or energy? Uh, energy. The AR should never really be physical, unless you're playing a physical mission like MSK, maybe? But that's pretty much it. Yeah, I think the only MSK Thank you for the bits. that I have physical is uh, is the launcher and uh, the fury. Uh, it's ask exclamation point add me, you guys. That's uh. And then if you do factor as well, you get a little link there. Ah, yeah, thank you, Seven. Points. I might have said Steven, but I don't know. It says Seven. It always gets so quiet at this time of night. I stream so late. I I guess this is late. Yeah, and some some people have uh, school in the morning and work. I wonder if I should start ending my streams at nine instead. Because it's always the last hour of the stream where my chat is basically asleep and we're just chilling. <laughs> we need more weekend streams. The problem with that is between seeing the girlfriend and streaming on Wednesday. I get two days out of my entire week where I have nothing planned. And those days are Sunday and Monday. So if I stream on Sunday, I lose one of my free days. And if I... 
stream on Saturday, then the girlfriend would be very upset, because I see her on Saturdays. So I just can't really stream on the weekends, as a, as a, as it is. I only got home an hour ago, wow. Alright, you welcome. Yeah, I guess I never thought of it like that, but... I am very much so sacrificing Saturday streams to hang out with the lady. I don't regret it, but well, I never thought about it until now. It's usually a pretty good day to go live. You know? But... That's okay. I get by. <laughs> you guys... Usually find me. But yeah, that's just my long way of saying, oh. like, I would, um... Normally I would like to do more weekend streams, it's just not really possible with my current pattern. And I'm on break right now, so streaming once a week is pretty much what I'm doing. What did you pick instead of school, Desi? What are you talking about? Why did you take three hours to get home? You get to shoot something this is Yeah, yeah, you know... It's just kind of a business thing. Like, I like streaming when I do stream. And if the bills are paid and the channel's growing, I guess it's fine if I miss a Saturday stream forever. You know, I'd, I'd start worrying about, gee, I need to start streaming on more, more on weekends if it was dire. <laughs> but actually, you know, audience members, maybe you guys can... Maybe you guys can agree or disagree. In my seven years of streaming, I have never found weekends to consistently be better for streaming. Does anybody in chat feel like they watch more on weekends? Because I don't think I've ever experienced consistently higher viewership on Saturdays and Sundays. I've just never seen that correlation even though you would expect more viewers on weekends. Yeah, yeah, because people are not, like, in work as much, and, you know, people are out of school. I absolutely have more time oh, to on the oh, weekend. Wait, right. Wait, 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 I found a Xenobo. Nice. You watch more during the week? <laughs> Interesting. Cheetah says he oh, watches I'm less. Sure. I'm a tutor and a full-time student. Oh, my God. That's too much work, Dizzy. Watch more on the weekends, because I watch the Monday Friday, so he's going to fill the time on the weekend. And yet, smoke is here, in most streams, when I'm not live on weekends. So I don't think I'd leave him. The, <clears throat> I mean, we see the correlation of when people are off, like, school and work. So, like, during summertime and then, uh, during but time, so that's when you're vacation. What I think it is, this is my best guess, is that, like, people still have a bit of free time, uh, in the evenings on weekdays. And the world is a big place. Like, I don't see significantly higher viewers on weekends, because Europeans exist. I've got people in school, out of school, not everybody in the world works at the exact same time. Some people have days off, and it all works out to where you can just stream whenever you're ready to go stream. Uh, it doesn't actually seem to matter. Some of my highest viewer numbers in my life were at like 2am, because... On a Monday. It's just how that happens. It's weird. Yeah. Sometimes there's a bit of a reverse effect where there are less viewers on the weekend or at, at like late at night, but also less streamers. So then you get more viewers because there's nobody else to watch right now. It's just there's so many factors and I have not found weekends to be a deciding one. I would not be interested in bullying, Sig. So I have tried that. I, I have had fun bully, bullying bullying, with friends, and I, I just... Oh, I would love to go bowling. I don't have very strong arms. My fingers always slip out of the holes. You can't eat while you bowl. I don't like it. Yes, or you would. can. Can what? Yes, you can eat when you bowl. You can't eat while you bowl. You get your fingers all greasy. Can't have fries and bowl. Just wipe it off. Wipe it off. You can't wipe grease off. You gotta clean your hands. 
I think the last time I bowled, it was like a 58. Much prefer Wii Bowling. Then my fingers hurt. Wii Bowling? Huh? Yeah, Wii Bowling. It's it's shit. Oh. Well, like the second that you said that, before you said that, my brother came in asking if we still had the Wii U, and I was like, no, I sold that like a long time ago. Yeah. So Get my fingers you. stuck in a tight places and <laughs> lifting a lot and pulling back with my Honestly. arm over and over and over. It just wears my fingers out. Oh, hey, hi, lady. Welcome. In the chat. Welcome. Looking back on it, the just only talking good, about you. I mean, I don't. I didn't really like the Wii U that much. I mean, bowling. Talking about bowling, not you. I mean, I keep my Wii around. Oh god, now Aura's talking I about his Wii. Keep my Wii U around. Shut up. The only game I played on that was the was Super Smash Bros, and that was it. <laughs> Wii Sports. Welcome back, Silver. We can just spend time doing things, you know? See, that's interesting. Like, that people would take their weekend to not watch streams and enjoy their free time, but then during the week, or potentially during work or school, that's when they would watch streams more. Like, it's really interesting that you would think, you would think all of my best streams ever, you know, streaming on the weekend makes a lot of sense, but... No. I oh, think I'm being messaged people... by the lady, I don't think she liked me talking about... Yeah, the first thing she heard was how weak my fingers are. Now she's sending the laughing emoji in my chat, in my Discord. Oh no! <laughs> Her first words That's in the stream were me talking it. about how weak my fingers are. You hate to see it. I I think people tend to like go do other things with the uh, like uh, family and stuff during the weekends. Mm-hmm. But during the weekdays, it's like they're coming home home from work and it's like. Well, since I'm winding down, I'll just put on a stream or a show. Yeah, and if you're an American viewer, then you're probably bored in class, so... You just watch the streams during school. That's what I did with Cradle. Literally played it when I was bored. I'm re-listening to the series right now. Fourth time through. On. All of my teammates saw that the encampment was right next to us, and I didn't. I went the wrong way. Oh my god. That's why she said what and disappeared. Yeah, I don't know where she went. Lady, are you still here? My fingers aren't that weak, I promise. Maybe that'll bait her back. Okay, good. That did. That, that did, did the trick, Did come get me? Need to tell her how strong my fingers are and she'll keep talking to me. At a certain point, though, words won't be enough. I need to prove to her that these fingers can hold tight. They can carry grocery bags in for her. So it looks like this weekend is going to be all about the fingers, huh? Mm-hmm. There's still chests over here. Uh, these. I am get in full. On that. We can only hold eight at a time, man. I don't need that many chests. <laughs> oh, I fucking I mean, hate walking to... slower than the enemy. If you need to, like, you know, get some resupply, then... You need to have something useful. What the fuck are you talking about? She never well, discusses this kind of thing, unless it's at my expense. Oh, I need I need to eliminate takers. This is the perfect mission for that. Why can't I... Game, why can't I call down the bo What? HA! Oh. Can somebody gift the lady a sub? I need my sub gifters back. I need to start streaming more to earn that. She said she logged into Twitch for three minutes and got two ad breaks already. That uh, is brutal. Yeah, that's Twitch for you. Come on, take her. I don't know if I have any gifters in chat though. Oh, Sig. Oh, Sig! <laughs> Thank you, Sig. Also, there's like 20 minutes left in the stream, so if anybody wants to piggyback that into a hype train, that was a good time. This will be the last hype train of the stream. If it happens. I will contribute if we hit level 3. Ooh. Aura's putting big money on level 3. 100 bits. 
Ben's War Cry. Any Yu-Gi-Oh players? I used to play Yu-Gi-Oh. I don't know if I ever played Yu-Gi-Oh. I collected the cards as a kid. I just got a bunch of Pokemon cards with Alini. Yeah, I used to collect Pokemon cards. I don't I don't I can't really understand the game all too much. It's not worth it. I wanna start collecting Pokemon cards again. I realize that regular cards are crazy expensive. Thank you again, Sig. And Yeah. We don't really need the super rare ones to enjoy them. So I started buying bulk. That's what I just did. 39 bucks for five stacks of 101 cards each. 535 cards for seven bucks each. That's, that's pretty insane. I flipped through it and it's hardly any duplicates. She got gifted a sub and it didn't end the ad. She's, she's saying this is funny. She's laughing at how excessive the ads are. Are they done yet? You're right on the collecting part, right? Also, Freddy, welcome. I'm sorry, I'm terrible at chat right now. So this is why people just randomly stop responding to me, is because they just get... They just get hit with an ad. Somebody did agree to everybody in chat for one minute. What was... That was 12 minutes ago. Did I just miss that? They did agree to everybody in chat. Uh-huh. That's why I missed it. Two people said hi. Two people said hi. I want a sub. I have eight ads. Can somebody give KJ and sub? <laughs> <coughs> I'm so glad I'm ending the stream soon. This throat needs a fucking break. Fishy boys. I gave the points back, Atomic. I don't want to. Nose picker. I bet you're breathing with both nostrils right now. Take it, Desi. Yeah, I know what I make from Twitch ads, and it is not that much. I don't know what Twitch is making from ads, but they are just hell bent on annoying people as much as they can with them. Three minute stream, and she watched two and a half minutes of ads. That's what she's telling me right now. Why are you DMing me this? I think one time I was trying to open your stream and Twitch kept giving me like six to eight ads. Like, I think this was before I subbed to you. That's okay, Cheetah. Oh, she redeemed a hydro. Oh, I just did that. Perfect. I'm drinking my advanced CG. Yeah, I... Thought I had my Twitch ad set up so that it... Plays... It plays the ads, um... Yeah, you're supposed to watch... 15 minutes before you get them. That's just a fucking lie. Why the fuck you lying, Twitch? My first ad delay. Okay, destroy. Oh, alright. Good. How many... What's my ad revenue? For Twitch. Oh, oh my god, I'm sorry. <clears throat> oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm gonna set this as low as it'll let me. Ad manager. And, oh, are you fucking kidding me? It says it all. All right. Someone wants to change your lights to dark blue. They just change it to my uh, favorite color. One of my favorite colors. Uh, it's uh, right. blue and purple. I set my ads to 30 seconds and an hour. 
instead of two minutes an hour. Yeah, so I made like nothing from ads in the last month compared to what you guys donate. <laughs> so I just I just turned it as low as it'll possibly go. Twitch is so disgusting with ads that I feel like people probably don't stick around because of them. Like she just said, she got three minutes of stream time and got hit with two and a half minutes of ads. That's unacceptable. What am I missing? They're just money hungry at this point. I don't even think that's it, because I know what my ads make, and if I'm making 30% and... They're not making that much, not for me. The amount of bits you guys buy and the subs you guys use, that's way more than the ads. I don't know yeah. why they make them. That is an Angry Bird, yeah. I got my yellow bird here to keep everybody in check. Um. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna get a last minute hype train. Thank you again, though, Sig. Well, it's a little late in the stream to see any results from that action, but hopefully ads are less crazy on Twitch now. I set it up a long time ago where it would never run an ad within the first 15 minutes of somebody being here. I felt like that was fair. But then it would start doing ads at a certain point, because to me that's an instant turnoff when I... Go to check in on a friend, oh, I wonder how so-and-so is doing, and then I click on their stream and get hit with a 30-second ad, and I go, never mind. Can't stand it. I thought, back in the day, Twitch partners used to not see ads, because the amount of money Twitch would lose from me not seeing ads is way less than I generate as a partnered streamer with an active fan base, so... Yeah. But I, I don't watch that many streams just in general, and I I can't form the habit, because every time I go to watch a friend on Twitch or check out anybody, I get hit, hit with a 30 second ad, and it's like, alright, fuck that, never mind. Never mind. I used to watch a lot of streams, and now I just, I can't. Puff Tower, yes, there's a Puff Tower. Change your light, oh, dark blue, I see. I hate it when somebody else tells me to do it. One person redeems points, and then another person nags me to do it. Pink Bear? Uh, I think that's Jigglypuff. I thought I got- yeah, the fish skin, I gave the points back, didn't want to do it. You click off instantly. Yeah. It's just... It's crazy. It'd be kind of fun to turn down those ads and see if, like, the average viewer count on Twitch just steadily improves as I stream. <laughs> like, oh wow, are you telling me if I... Reduce ads, people stick around and watch my streams more? No way. It's crazy how it works. No. <laughs> Alright, I got unlucky with Lakebeard's stash, and now I'm starting over. Click on the stream, not a 30 second unskippable ad. Yeah, you wanna hug people first! Give me a reason to stay, and I'll, I'll sit through the ad. If I click on a stream, yeah. and the first thing I see is an ad, I'm gone. Twitch, do you have any idea how many options I have? I have so many bookmarks, YouTube, Netflix, so many streaming services. I just wanted to say hi to a friend and see what they were doing, and I got hit with an ad before I could find out. Bye. <laughs> Bye, I didn't care that much. That's that's my internal dialogue. I'm like, oh, I wonder what Austin's up to. Ooh, I wasn't that curious. Yeah, the system, the systems you, you, the systems like working against the streamers. Oh, heavily. That's why I wonder, like, the amount of money I might have spent on this platform, buying bits and donating to friends who are doing some kind of thing. The amount of subs I haven't bought, because like, ads ran me away. I don't know. I just don't know. But, I turned it down to as low as it'll go. So we'll see if that makes a difference. And hopefully that'll make people less upset. Yeah, you know, sometimes viewers of mine go a little crazy with sub gifting, but even the most insane sub gifters, it's only a few hundred gifted subs with thousands of people that tune in. That's just, that's just, that yeah, doesn't fix it, you know. One crazy I donor. I think some of the times that I've been there, it, 
it was just off the handle. Uh, it's probably the only upside of YouTube. That's the main one. Blocking ads on YouTube is really easy. Um, but most of my YouTube ad re YouTube revenue comes from ads, <laughs> so I prefer you guys not. Uh, where are Twitch ads all the while? No, I'm just on a rant about them. I'm tired. I always am after a long stream. Yeah. <sighs> it's actually cool how many people get it. I Like, I never have to explain myself when I complain about being tired on stream. It's like anybody who's ever had to talk for any extended amount of time is like, yep. Oh, that's how it feels. It's amazing that it's been eight hours now. Wow, wow, wow. Lady, how are you doing? Talk to us. I felt like this day has gone by, like, steadily. Mm-hmm. Can't really, can't really describe it, but I feel like this day has gone really stead steady. I'm doing okay, I'm reading. She's reading. Oh, what book are you reading? Lego sent me a catalog of Lego stuff. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to give it to her and hope she still has money by the end of the month. <laughs> <laughs> I always... The one Lego set that I always wanted was the Death Star, but that thing just is so expensive. I just, I didn't feel like buying it. We could probably just start. It's not a four player mission. Oh, uh, yeah, that's good. Um, Falcon, you want to you wanna come over here and uh, do the thing? Did that catalog include Fortnite? I don't know. I flipped through it, but I didn't really. Barely come back to the after all these years. Gina, I've got so many videos for you to watch. Videos that are three and four years old are still just fine. This game hasn't changed too dramatically. Goth written by... I'm Chino, sorry. I, I, I I'm sure I got enough videos to keep you entertained forever. I don't know how to say that name. I've got like a thousand Save the World videos up. I've made 4,500 videos, YouTube told me. It's just that I've unlisted like 3,000 of them. They're just old streams. Every daily video gets unlisted. I have one public daily video on my channel. Maybe two. And I'm guessing those are story videos. What? And I'm guessing those are like recap videos of like uh, the case and, and stuff. Hmm. How do I join? To get help. That's not what this stream is. You don't. Yeah, you can join the Discord and hopefully there'll be people in there to help you. <clears throat> that is the better place to ask. Rit oh wait, so it's, it's a crime story and he writes books where everyone's a psychopath. Interesting. You know, lady, this is just too much to discuss. We should just get you in the call. <laughs> Cause that's the thing, like, I'm, I'm really interested in, like, crime sort of stuff. Like, I watch a lot of documentaries about that stuff. Like... Instant no. <laughs> Instant no. Oh, uh, getting them in the Discord, that is what they're asking about. Oh, my bad. I didn't read. I'm being a bad streamer. How dare you. Mm hmm Minigun loadout is uh -oh. great, yeah. Minigun loadout is very strong. Um, I don't know if you... Did you see the thing that me, Beast... Or no, not Beast. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, wait. I don't know if Storm was still here. Or it was about that Jeb, that Jeb thing. Or I think you were there for that, right? Jet thing. What are we talking about? 
where everyone's like name was like oh. Jeff or someone. That, did you see that or no? Oh, Greg. Re Greg, that was it. Like everyone was like naming themselves like Greg something. Greg. Everyone was like. Yeah, so that came off of, uh, basically that happened because, uh, we were talking about the first time, uh, the Greg invasion happened. That's fun, and Zig. for some reason we just all changed our names to Greg for, like, yeah. one day. <laughs> she did join the call once. It was so fun. Yeah. Yeah, I think she did join that call whenever... There were, like, 80 people in the chat, though, so just a quiet little end-of-the-night treat for those who stuck around. I think she joined when we were doing the the, the Greg thing. The, I don't think so. How I got in it was I asked Storm God, I was like, why is your name Greg? And then musician just dragged me into that PC where everyone was at, and I was like, oh, <laughs> okay. She never joined the Discord calls. She was in my oh. stream once. Oh, I thought she was. Oh, never. Lady, did no, you ever join a Discord a call? Thing. No, she was not in the correct thing. I think he might I, be rude. I could have saw. Okay, no, never it mind. It was Bunny. Oh. I am not oh. Pingo. Don't confuse me with Pingo. Yes, what? Wait, you oh. joined a random Discord call once? Alright, this is too confusing. You should join my call right now and we can clear this up. <laughs> I'm just. Okay, I, I think do not I don't know if it was her or Bunny. It would have been Jigglypuff Pong. No, that one time I think. It. Okay, all right, all right. Let me just. Okay, I'm just confusing everybody. Lady, now. I'm I, saying. I start. I'm. I was talking about the time where you let me call you while I was streaming, and you talked for like an hour. He's talking about a Discord call that happened off stream. It was just kind of its own thing. Yeah, that happened off stream. I. I, I was confusing with somebody else. I'm completely sorry about that, Jigglypuff. <coughs> I'm gonna hear about it later that you called her Jigglypuff. That's her favorite thing. Eraser Girl, thank you so much! Oh, I'm a lot better now. Can't just throw a thousand bits at me and not wake me the fuck up. I was getting tired. It was the end of the stream. Ah! Aura's no, just... Aura. Okay, no, what Aura. the fuck. Eraser Girl, you see oh, what no, you've done? I they're gonna make me keep streaming if this if this continues. Give me the email. Oh no. Thank you so much. Hype train level one. I have all the level one emails. Alright, I'll let them know. She's no, DMing me right now. The ladies. Oh, it's trap. Oh, it's yeah. trap warnable. Hold on. Uh, let me try and get to something. Do you have access to live? Boom. Destroyed. Sounded okay, a bit low. I'm track. just tired. <laughs> I'm a little sick and it's been a long day. Eight hours is a lot to talk straight with a sore throat. But thank you so much. You're definitely uh, helping me end the stream on a good note. Are we gonna finish level one though? It's been a couple of a uh, couple of people. Racer Girl Nora. If you've been hanging on to a prime sub, gift sub, normal sub, now's a great time because any of that would get you in on the hype train. Get some hype train emotes. Help some other people avoid the ads on Twitch. <laughs> Eight hours of drain one social. You know, not social batteries. I get charged up talking to people. I'm just physically tired. It drains my normal batteries talking for eight hours. Especially since I'm a little sick anyway. Beast is such a slut for hype trains. I know, right? You're saying that the full time streamer enjoys these phenomenons that encourage people to donate? How dare he? How dare he garner support from his fan base? <laughs> like a streamer horror. I think You're a trooper. I appreciate it, Razor Girl. How have you been? I don't think I've seen you in a little while. Although I haven't been an active streamer. Enjoy. TJ! Wow, that cup never even had a chance to get splashed. You guys aren't fucking around. That leaderboard is so fresh. You just went to the number two spot. Oh, damn. Already? Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Thank you so much. When are you going to end the stream? Well, after this game was the plan, but if a hype train's going to happen, I'm going to have to at least see the hype train through. 
I have never ended yeah, a stream yeah, no, with an active hype train going. You don't I have to feel never. obligated to keep streaming, even though you said that you were gonna get off at ten. You don't I will, feel obligated to stay on. I will run missions until the hype train ends. If you're gonna keep that going, I'll, I'll happily see that through. Thank you so much. We get back to it eventually. So what have you been Thank up to? Thank you for always being you. I remember the most, ex I think the most exhausted I've ever been is after my marath, after my uh, little marathon stream of uh, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. I was. How long did you stream? Exhausted. Uh, basically, I woke up soon for the entire day, uh, and then went to bed for like five days straight. Oh, damn. Wow, I didn't even know you did that. Thank you again, TJ, Eraser, Aura. If anybody wants any hype train emotes, no 100 bits is the minimum to get one of these emotes. Um, you can prime sub for free as well. That's probably the, the best way. This happened when Pokemon Scarlet and Violet were released. I see, and you just binged it. Yeah. I was on a call with friends the whole time, so it was really fun. <laughs> also, there was a winter storm happening at the time, so couldn't really. New job, single mom now. Oh no! Oh no. Although it sounds like it was a good thing. Nothing like having peace in your life. Do we have a crazy divorce story? No, you don't, uh, Zachary. Give, give us the juice. Uh, if you're comfortable with it, of course. Okay. She's descri She's DMing me in detail what this serial killer gets up to in the books, and I- This is horrifying. Thank you uh, yeah, again, Eraser Girl! Oh, damn. Thank you so much. To what extent is it horrifying? Is no it crazy like... divorce story. Well, I guess I don't know where she started. Like, single mom now. Were you always single and now there's a kid? Or did somebody pass away? Or... All right. I have so many questions. And none of them so might yield answers. fun answers. I am <laughs> feel like I'm treading on careful territory here. How about another hour? If we get to hype train level 10, I'll do another hour about that. Oh, man. I'm a single okay. dad of three as of yesterday. Okay. Wait, what? How does that happen? Wait, what? Oh, yeah. I uh, got Dragon Scorch to 144 now. Wait, so what you do? The as of thing is just what's confusing me. Like, are, are you newly divorced? Master, or did you also kick the husband out shortly after Christmas? I see. Oh, I see. So he was doing something not so good. Or maybe he was doing not her. You know what I mean? Uh, that's an easy way to piss off yeah. the wife. Yeah. Nineteen not years with the easiest way to piss off a wife: not being loyal. Thatchmaster said 19 years with the same woman and she found a new man. 19 years! Oh. Jesus. Woo! Well, this stream uh -oh. just got heated out of nowhere. Little reminder, hype train's still active. We got about three minutes on the timer. He was literally doing nothing for me. I want to hear wow. the rest of this. Yeah, between uh, that and, and Ezra. Oh. <laughs> 10 years doing nothing for me. Three kids under 10. Oh my god. Three. Oh my god. That has to be chaotic. Yeah. <laughs> we just got. I. He said I after. Feel sorry for both of you. He said as of yesterday. I'm sorry. Sounds like they're both thrilled about their. Both of them are so happy with how peaceful things are. I'm only getting good vibes from these stories right now, which is. Hilarious. I mean, yeah. Wait, it, you're getting good vibes uh, from those stories? They're both talking about how peaceful they are. She said, blessed, nothing like oh, having oh, peace oh. in your life. He said, so peaceful today with just the kids. Like, this, this is... Oh, well, that's good. Yeah, no, if your partner is, like, 
he could Being dick, a douche then... or... Yeah. Wow, wow, wow. Or just like making your life miserable. Yeah, just... Dump them, get rid of them. So I've yeah, got... Get, yeah, get the, get the fuck... Get them out of your lives. You're better off without them. <laughs> Lady, say that in the stream chat. Don't DM me that. What? She's what talking about her mom that? loving her divorce as well. Oh. <laughs> it's like she's Come getting on. in on it. Join she's relating it. to the people in chat. To me, I don't... I mean, my parents are still happy, happily married, so I can't really relate. She says very peaceful. That's actually true. Her mom is like the happiest retired woman I've ever heard. She's taking like piano classes, learning drums. Not piano. She's taking... A bunch of different classes, just a bunch of different stuff. Uh, one minute left on the hype train. It was mostly Eraser and, and TJ there pushing it along, so I, I think that's probably where it's gonna end. But last call, you know. Come on. Last call. Drum retirement? classes. Was it not? You're laughing. Is she laughing because drum classes is funny, or because I got the wrong thing? Wasn't she taking piano as well, or did she already take piano? I mean, she's Chinese. She probably took piano at some point, but. I wish my grandma could have that happy retirement. All right, got my gifts. She's taking drum classes. Yeah, I thought so. So like, she's doing that. She's oh, she just told me what she was up to, and it's not coming to my brain right now. I no work. Brain's I'm eyeing the hype train timer. It's stressing me out. <laughs> Seeing if we're gonna if we're gonna call it there. You needed level three, didn't you? Ora? Well, you were just kicking off right away, so you're already in on well, it. Well, Ezra and that I'm. No, I'm glad piano. you guys are doing well for yourselves. Yeah. Uh, I, I need level 3 to be completed. Cause I think it's going. Yeah. Level 3 is the last set of emails I need. No fighting that. Uh, See, that's yeah. awful. Like, when you make it 19 years with somebody, I would expect that you have no intentions of finding another person. Yeah, exactly. That's got to be... My a big deal. But they seem I... happy. Maybe it's a long time coming. Maybe it wasn't a happy 19 years. Yeah. I don't know. Didn't notice there was more levels after 50. Yeah, 50 adventures is the end of the ventures specific rewards. But you get reperk and some stuff after that. It's not usually worth it after 51. 51 is where I stop. She has all the money and no man to tell her what to do. Exactly. Yeah. She has... Oh, so, okay, so it was drum class... Let me see if I can remember. It was drum classes. She was doing... Fuck. Apparently learning English. But I, I told the lady the things I would tell her mom, and I, I was, she was very upset at me. So I need to, I need to learn English as well, apparently. Um, let her know what an excellent Kirby player her daughter is. <laughs> It's pronounced Eraser Girl. Isn't that what I said? Or maybe TJ said something else. I wasn't listening. Oh, oh, my bad. <laughs> yeah, when she said that, I was like, oh, that's I'm, that's exactly I'm what I... I'm very terrible. I'm, I'm very terrible with pronouncing certain names, so I do apologize to everybody if I, if I butcher your name. Anyway, her mom's up to all sorts of stuff. Couldn't be offended. Yeah, I'm curious that sh if if either of you want to elaborate, because I'm curious how that can devolve. How can we avoid these these situations? You know. Let us learn from. Let us learn. What went wrong? Because you know, 19 years. Thanks, Eraser. He said, "New man." He did not elaborate, though. It's probably painful. No, I'm gonna pry too hard, but I am curious. You know, you guys brought me some juice here, some 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 juicy juicy drama. Kind of curious. Jesus. Yeah. That's not what I was. <laughs> I, I mean, before you guys came in and told us all that, like, we were just. This is a very quiet room chilling. before. I was winding it's down, like, ready to quietly end the thing. stream. I'd be raiding right now, and now I'm asking about this. Ex wife came back from vacation with friends. She had his Canucks hockey jersey and tragically hip shirt. Told me it was her friends. I then found out about him. Then she tried to bring my kids to his house for the weekend. I enjoy destroying his jersey and shirt. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. So out of nowhere How? then. What an idiot she was trying to take the kids to his house. Wow. 19 years. You expect like loyalty 
and trust. But nah, she took that and just, just threw it away, right out the window. Yeah, no, that just that just screams like, yeah, no, fuck you, you're worthless now. Uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm just baffled. Maple says he's yawning right now. Maple, are you just so bored? She just met yeah, him and she wanted to bring our kids to his house. What the fuck? Like, how do you you guys? Go ahead, go ahead. My bad. Nineteen years. How do you? That's what I was gonna say. Just meet a guy and go. You know, oh, oh we're done now. You. I'm uh. leaving you and I'm taking the kids. Like, bro, bitch, get the fuck out of here. Momo, I did not expect to still be alive, but we got a impromptu hype train and then some life drama. Wow. Oh my god. Well, I hope... I don't... I don't know. I'm tired. I've been up for 16 hours. I kinda hope she regrets it later. I'm still curious. Like, is this... Is this new behavior? Did he kinda see this coming? Is there precedent for this? I don't know. These are things I wanna know. I just, I just hope she regrets it something, tries coming back to him, but I bet he's not going to take her back. Like, hell fucking no. Yeah, it's new. I appreciate you sharing, Thatch Mazda. Love yeah. the username. Just, I have to keep saying that with a straight face. Uh, I, I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm, I'm sorry. It's weird. When I was helping Mario out with his 160s earlier before reset, I found like five uh, modules just in a straight line. But now I'm not finding any. Like, really? Oh no. I found everyone's favorite weapon in an Infinity Machine. Is it Xenobo? Does it begin with an M? <clears throat> Yep. <laughs> oh, um, yeah, me too. <laughs> mm. oh. I just don't see... I don't... I mean, all jokes aside, I don't know why people think that the nailer is good. Like, Okay, they don't. It's like a meme. It? I don't know what compels somebody to throw away a relationship like that. Like, yeah, what could have a guy like that offered? To torch, like, 19 years. Even if you started in your teens, like, you're not spring chickens anymore. That's, that's a long that's, fucking time. That's a long, like, There's a lot of history long there. And serious, long history, serious relationship, stuff like that. Like, you would expect, like, your wife to be, or ex-wife, to be, like, loyal, truthful to you, and honest, like, 100% of the time. But then to go and do that? Like, I don't know. You need to get out. I'm still curious about a racer girl here, because 10 years sounds like nothing compared. <laughs> yeah, like, Kidding. My parents, but my parents have been married for like 25 years now, and if something like that happens, then... Well, she said he was know. doing nothing for her, but I don't know what that means. Was he... Was he kind of a deadbeat? Was he just a drain? Because that's a very proactive response, kicking him out to a very inactive verbiage. My last straw was when she told me to go- oh my god. Oh, oh my god. What? It sounds like a mental break. That- When she told- I think- When I she told know. her? I don't wanna... Was bad. What the fuck? Wow. Oh my god, so... So she basically tried to use that against- that- that's fucked, okay? No matter what, like... That is straight fucked. It keeps getting worse. Yeah, after that, dude, happy you need to, days ahead. You need to do everything you can to get away from her. Well, see, he like, says happy days ahead. I feel like 19 years, yeah, you gotta have a... Feel... You gotta have a little slum period mourning the loss yeah, of the relationship, but he a, seems happy. That doesn't sound like this came out of nowhere. 
This sounds like erratic yeah. behavior. Did she warm up to this kind of thing? Wow, that was a lot of no crits. I... Not That's, at all. I'm, I'm completely sorry. Well, for a racer girl, game. I'm not. I'm talking about Thatch. Thatch. Warming up. Yours. I said too many things. I don't know what not at all is referring to. I can't even guess. I only got about three minutes left in this mission chat, and then I got a person I'm not and, cheating yeah. on to go talk to, so. I'm... <laughs> I hope isn't cheating on me. Oh, that could be. We can work with yeah, that. Yeah, no, let's not, let's not start anything. We can work with that. It keeps giving me peg legs that are lower than my other weapons. I, I I wasn't doing much in this mission because I was so distracted by what was going on. My mom was also married for a long time. She's just so happy to get rid of him. Yeah. I've heard stories about... I know that situation. I'm happy for her mom, too. <laughs> yeah. Your mom should be proud. Oh, god damn it. Fucking teleports. Oh, I didn't... Oh, I... I thought I was still running Cloak Star, but no, I'm running Dragon Scorch now. <laughs> Good time and I'm off for dinner in five minutes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're just gonna give me a taste of this story and then say, Alright, well, dinner. Bye. We want more. <laughs> I'm kidding. I want more. But I wanna hear but, about this. But hey, uh that's I'm completely sorry about that again, dude, and I you say that you're happy, dude, then then I'm glad you're happy, dude. And erase same goes for you too. I'm really sorry that happened, but I hope things are going well for you as well. We haven't gotten any details on Eraser Girl. No, so she hasn't know. elaborated. Yeah. Maybe but next time she from, comes by. From, the look, from the looks of what that's got us so far, I, I, I think she's, I think she's fucking crazy. <laughs> You got the kids, and that's all that matters, huh? That's mm. good. Last thing you want is your kids being with that crazy witch. And, <laughs> yeah. God damn. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I just... When people do something like that, like it's use their like, mental stuff against them, that's... That's just fucked. It's pretty that's manipulative. Just, that's just my... I'm, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> I just feel bad for people that have to go through that. I feel like no one shouldn't. Did you stop by when the stream's about to end? Yes, you did. Cannibal. Did he despawn right there? Oh my lord. Wow. Oh, I'm on it. Oh, I forgot to switch to metal. Over here, bud. I hope we don't fail in the last six seconds. Uh, we might be good. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. Half an arm babies. Oh my god. Well, I'm definitely gonna have to ask for more next time you two stop by. Get an update or something. Are level robbers really gone? Yes. Yep, they are. They they were gone with the uh, Ferris quest ever since uh, a couple hours ago. Not to barrel through like DiGiorno's on Twitter, but I'm hearing this in the background while ventures, and it sounds like a funeral at the last minute of the mission. Well, yeah, it's two people ending long-term relationships. <laughs> kind of a like a, a weirdly positive gloom subject at the same time yeah and we're not getting any details and it's not not, not any any well, any except for uh for tasha a little bit of details. Say his name. i'm just i'm just gonna keep calling that's okay raid time goodbye discord we gotta find somewhere to go here zinc welcome yeah i appreciate it that's master don't go anywhere. We need to get you guys all some channel points. 
Yoltrons and Storm God restarted to save the world. Alright, fuck it. I'm not gonna overthink it. I am out of here. I'm gonna go stand up. I'm gonna stretch my legs. Next stream will probably be on, on Wednesday. Um, please check out Factor 75. You guys can get half off your first box. Ready-made meals. Prepped for you. No mess. No prep. They're uh, two minutes in the microwave. Super delicious. And 50% off your first box. Trying to get six orders. We're at three. So if three of you go and check it out, it really would mean a lot to me. I get a direct kickback. You guys get yummy food. Everybody wins. Everybody wins. All right, Yeltrons is a fun guy. He's a goose. And it has restarted Fortnite. So, um... You guys can go say hi there. I do Candy Valley quest. Oh, but I didn't finish quest to open weekly supercharger. I didn't finish quest and then I suddenly got 100 people. Yeah, it happens randomly. Just enjoy it. Is he really a goose? He is. I met him at TwitchCon. He's an actual goose. Definitely look into it. I'd appreciate it, Smoke. I really do. I think it's good for the next week, so. You know, check it out. Oh, damn. Emerald's throwing bits around. Going crazy over here. Might be able to kick off a hype train. 